Let's record this for YouTube. Hey, what's up, YouTube? Can't wait for this to get immediately copyright claimed from the music, but here we go. Starting up Final Fantasy X. If you haven't watched yet, the Final Fantasy IX video is out. Also, thanks for watching the VODs over on my gameplay channel. I really appreciate it. You can always catch me live over at twitch.tv slash projared to watch me live. It would mean a lot to me if you did, but I also thank you for watching here on the VODs. So, let me hit record right away to get capture footage going. Got my notes all ready to go. Uh, let's see. This seems very loud. Bring it down. What's the bonus audio? Oh, is this not what I want? This is not what I want. Shit. Oh, is this the, um... Is this the radio drama? Shit, I don't want this. Undo. Undo. I'm out. Alright, we're off to a great start, everybody. Stop. Unfollow. <laughs> I don't know if we can stop. Help. It was great. It really was. Stop. No. I can't skip it. Alright, we're off to an awesome start. I'm so sorry. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> I, th I thought that was like the audio settings for the game. Uh, turns out it's not. Whoopsie doodle. Oh no, the audio's all fucked up. Oh fuck, dude. <laughs> Hold on, fixing audio. <laughs> Woo! Okay. Don't worry about it. Professional streamer. That's why y'all followed, right? Alright, I'm just gonna go and delete that. All right. There we go. Still seems very loud to me. You're like there. All right. Now we're actually going. Thank you, Greybeard. Margu, appreciate it. So I'm gonna point something out to you guys right away that this game does, and I can't fucking stand it. And once you see it, you can never unsee it. And it happens in every single cutscene, and it drives me nuts. I don't know why they did this. It's that during cutscenes, what they like to do is whenever they go from one shot to another, they'll freeze the final frame of the previous shot and crossfade it into the next shot. And it makes no goddamn sense, because when you do a crossfade, that usually implies like a passage of time. But for whatever reason, they try to do it as a stylistic thing, and they do it all the time, and I can't stand it. I hate that. It makes no fucking sense. And it happens throughout the entire game. It works, looks worse on like PS2 because uh, 
Because like on a CRT, like, you know, it blends together in even more. I hate it. I hate it. Standards for your grid. You have selected standard. Yes. Original. Now let's watch that again. <laughs> this is my story. See, like, going from, like, piece of scenery and establishing shot, crossfading into the main subject or the characters there, makes sense. Like, that's an okay crossfade. But going just from, like, hand on, on Yuna's shoulder to, like, a different angle of Yuna... Why? Why?! I hate it. Like, even when I first played it in PS2, couldn't stand it. Why does it bug me so? I don't know, because I kind of understand cinemato cinematography and composition. <laughs> Final Fantasy Crossfade. <laughs> Listen to my story. This may be our last chance. So, another really interesting thing with Final Fantasy X is that the story becomes way better the moment that you realize and acknowledge and accept to yourself that Titus is not the main character. So like Vaughn in 12? Pretty much, yeah. I mean, like, the whole thing is, in the narration is just Tina's going like, this is my story. Listen to my story. Blah, blah, blah. When, like, it's not, it's Eunice. And he is just a side character. And again, once you realize that, the story, like, becomes better. What's up, kids? Can you sign this? No problem. Please. All righty. Me too. You're not even holding a pen. Take it easy. Immersion ruined. Ladies. Not of you. Course. Good All right, luck tonight. First, no. Nothing to worry about. Cutscene. Oh, Crossfade bullshit. I'll uh, do this. That will mean it was for you, okay? <laughs> what 
what seat? Ace walk in the front row! Fifth from the right! Got it. Takarashi, it's the five dollar GP toss. Cheer for me. Two, three. Teach us how to blitz. Hey, I, I got a game to play. Then teach us after. Maybe tonight. Um, no. You can't tonight. I mean tomorrow. Promise. Promise. I like your zip off shorts, Titus. Praise be to you, Evan. Come on, Coon. Thanks for the tier two resub. Happy fun ball with Twitch Prime. <laughs> I was in a coffee shop running away from home when I heard the news. Our hero, checked, gone, vanished into thin air. <laughs> My dad must have been his biggest fan. I knew how sad he'd be. Heck, we all were that day. Not the Xanarkin Douglas. What are you thinking? I went running straight back home. We sat up talking about Jack all night. My dad and I never talked so much. Whoa, didn't mean to reminisce, folks. Anyway, 10 years later, the Jack Memorial Cup tournament is today. The two teams that have won through to the finals are, of course, the Abes from A East and the Duggles from C South. I know there's a lot of people out there today to see the star of the Abes. In just one year, Ran too fast. Interrupted the voiceover. Make way, make way. Coming through. Sorry. Look at my little run. <laughs> little jogging hey, place. I'm gonna be late. Oh, I'm running like Sid from Final hey, Fantasy VII. Let go of me. Oh no! Not all these people with their hands on me. Oh no. It's interesting is like when you don't when the uh voice actors don't have to like try to lip sync at all Sweet. or match the lip flaps, like the delivery is actually pretty good. And that's why Oron ends up being one of the better characters, because his mouth is always covered. So his delivery is much more natural. Overhyped song! Not that cool. Yep, this world's fucked. Time to drink it away. Water rugby! That man's dead. How are you propounding yourself up in the air so much? Oh, fuck.
RPG Wiz, Mr. Anderson, thanks for the resubs. Sigma Vash, Lord Dreamer gifting a sub. Hydrate. Huh. Orin! What are you doing here? Chillin'. I was waiting for you. What are you talking about? Huh? This city's like cool looking though. Like I dig the the look of the city. I had some like cool like cityscape establishing shots. Huh? Uh. Oh, okay. Huh? I guess we're starting off weird. Just right away. It begins. What? Don't cry. That's one of the fate, right? Hey, not this way. Look. Yeah. Yeah, just swat them like flies. Good job, Titus. Take it. I brought you this. Pointy end. That transition is straight These into battle, though. Matter. We cut through. Hell yeah. Is Tita's or Vaughn worse? Oh, Vaughn is worse. Tita's at least has plot relevance. Your boy Guzma and Hurt Zilla with the resubs. Pro Cake Cypher off 150 bits. Is this a blind play? I've played this before. I've played this before. Granted, it's been like two decades since I last played it, but I played it before. When a character's overdrive gauge beneath it, HP MP displays full, they can go apeshit. 
Wow, Orin's pissed! Get fucked! Oh, shit. I'm helping. <laughs> oh, a Tidus overdrive? Sure. Oops. Fuck, fuck off! What do you got? Power break? Nah. Am I gonna get anima Yojimba? I don't know. Notice there's significant input lag with the overdrives? That's what it seemed like when I was like just now. Like I was pinning it like dead on and it's like too slow. Honestly, Sino, same. When people make fun of the laughing scene, it's just because everyone doesn't know the context of it and keeps being shown without context. And it turns out context uh, is important. All right, go ahead and save the game. Oops, yes, I want to save. I choose noise with the resub. What are you laughing at, old man? Lauren, let's get out of here. We're expected. Huh? Give me a break, man. Oh, it does still do the fuzzy thing. Oh, I hate that too. Uh, this was like a weird fad during PlayStation 2, where it's like, try to make things look I don't know, cooler or... I don't even know what you would call it. But they do this thing where like, they make like this, during movement, there's like a, like a, like a shadowed effect. I never noticed that Orin's little head follows around where I'm pointing the, the cursor. That's adorable. Yeah, but it does like this like weird like motion, not even like true motion blur, but they do it a lot in cutscenes, and um, they did it a lot on PlayStation 2 games. Like God of War did it, this game does it, but even like games that didn't need it, did it like Wheel of Fortune on PS2, but it's like really bad. Hmm. This could be bad. That, knock it down. What? Trust me, you'll see. Yeah, it's like you remember, remember like playing Kingdom Hearts. You know, where, like when you finish a battle, and like it does that, like. like and they're all like, oh, slow-mo with motion blur. Like that effect, only it happens all the time in in areas and places that doesn't need it. that
Is the HD of this any good? I'm, I'm playing the HD version right now. Bushman is watching! This for 55 subs! Dude, here's the, like the motion blur a little bit. Here's not so bad, because at least in the slow mo and kind of fits the context of the explosion. Oren! Oren! You are sure. You're just talking about it. This is it. This is your story. It all begins here. <laughs> <laughs> so at that point, Sin, uh, spoilers for anyone who's not played again, a game hey. already, but like Sin is who I think it is, hey. right? And that's why Aaron's already just talking to it. Do I got that right? Again, I remember the broad strokes of this game. It is? Okay. I thought about a lot of things. Like, where I was, what I got myself into. I started to feel lightheaded, Sweet. and then sleepy. I think I had a dream, a dream of being alone. I wanted someone, anyone beside me, so I didn't have to feel alone anymore. Bird friend? Anybody there? Aaron! Hey! The minimap actually kind of helpful in this game. My camera's mostly covering it up, but since there's no like pre rendered background or whatever, and you're not super sure what you can actually like go on or interact with, I feel like the other minimap actually kind of helpful in this game compared to something like Final Fantasy 13, where it's fucking worthless. We'll see if that thought retains itself though, because that might change later on. Introduction to Albed. I'm slowly going to decipher the Albed language. Oh, no. Oh, this is where if you've already played the game, you can unload up. That's right. I thought that was one of the, uh, 
Ooh, treasure? Has Final Fantasy 13 hurt me? No! I forgive it! Treasure? Treasure. $200? Something is written here. It draw my fan of pumped goof maker, even shed a draw, pmiglias hacred. The third of Macalanyar pairs, draw wunder and may been we secret. What do we have here? Nope. Can't read it. I think lighting is hot. Ugh, man, lighting's too boring. Hey, WP, thanks for the reset. I am pushing the buttons that the screen is telling me to push. Treating my Twitch stream like it's a quick time event. Also, thank you for resubbing. You just think pink hair girls are hot? Yeah, I mean, gotta type. Freaking high potion right away? Jeez. What fashion brand did they use lighting as a model for? It was for Gucci. Like, straight up. So there's that uh, motion blur effect I was telling you about. Blur. Fuck you. You know what's interesting? I I like the battle song of this game, but I don't like how they use it in this game. Like I think it's a good song, but I don't like how hard it starts. Motion blur. Which Final Fantasy is the best battle theme? Final Fantasy IX does. Final Fantasy IV is the best ba boss battle theme. See, what I like about the um, earlier Final Fantasy games is they kind of do a natural... Uh, they do like a natural like build to the battle. And that is kind of all established by the baseline, almost like the game kind of gives you that baseline and that um, moment to like process and establish what's happening. 
Let's bring the volume down a little bit more. Like when you see something get into a, a battle and there's a bunch of enemies, like there's a moment while it's going dun 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 which again, it's like a great start, but it's like just hard right away before I you can even like die in this place. know what you're looking at. So like I don't like I do like the ten battle song. Don't get me wrong. It's just like it's like a, a jarring hard start compared to other Final Fantasy battle themes. Yeah, I'm not saying it's like flaw or bad or somehow makes it a bad song. I'm not saying that by any means. I just I like the uh I just like that build up. Cold. Need uh, fire. <sighs> any stuff? I just realized that this song has a little bit of the motif of Suteki Dine. Right? Am I hearing that right? That's where I came in from. That way. There's a lot of camera ankle cuts, Jesus. There is no walk option, I have to run. I'm pressing examine. Oh, there we go. Alright. Obtained flint! circle. Oh, okay. I just figured it'd be like gently push analog stick, but nope. Now how am I supposed to RP walk? Eh? I got a withered bouquet. Treasure? Hmm. Just a high potion. Mm -hmm. Oh, heck. Well, before we go on uh, too much further, Palinlock says he wants to open up a booster pack. You wanna? We can. Palinlock has redeemed his chat gold pieces to open up a booster pack of his choosing. In case you guys are new here, you can watch the stream, earn chat gold pieces, and use those gold pieces to open up a uh, booster pack. And he has chosen Time Spiral Remastered. Let's see what we get. We're looking for some big old mythics or some foil time shifted cards. Let's count the commons. Here's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Here's number nine, number 10. <gasps> Ooh, number 10's an uncommon, which means we do have a foil in here. All right, Paladin Lock, let's see what you've opened up with the chat TP. All right, we've got, what is this? 
Henchfiend of the Ukor. Uh, a Thalid. Next on comment is the Cloud Seeder. Yep. And then your first rare card is... Coalition Relic. Isn't this a commander card? Yeah, three mana artifact and a mana of any color. You can put a charge counter on it to do some stuff. Wasn't this a thing? All right, your rare's Coalition Relic. We got more cards to look at, though. Your time-shifted card is Ooh, Ramanop Ruins. First introduced in uh, Amonkhet. Excellent card. This is the uh, desert land that you can sacrifice to deal two damage to each opponent by sacrificing any desert. And then your foil card is... Foil Needle Peak Spider. This is a foil, just a foil common, sadly. Which is just a four mana, four two reach in red. And it's also just warped to shit. But there you go. That's what you've opened up here, Palin Lock. Coalition Relic and a time shifted Ramanop Ruins. And now let's get back to our regularly scheduled Final Fantasy X. Got any Urza Saga boosters open? Sadly, no. Veggie 100 bits. Do I find Spira interesting? I need food. I don't remember. It's a whole ass mood, Titus. What do you want? was a bad call. Hero of Time, thanks for subscribing. My second brand new baby sub of the day. You came to say that. Also, Pummon resubbing. It's been 10 years. I thought you'd be crying. Who, me? You cried. Fuck you, kid. I always remember that part for some reason. Oh, some wood. Like dancing back and forth. Ah, oh, Titus so tired. Titus so fast, getting two hits in. That's crit. Motion blur. An explosion is so cool. We got to show it three times. Riku, I never noticed the belt going just straight through your crotch. You on my side? Cool. Any stuff? 
A grenade! I remember when uh, this game was out, there was a lot of people like, oh, fuck yeah, dude, Riku, she's so fucking hot. Oh, especially in 10-2 when she's in a bikini, like her titties are out. And it's like, she is literally like a teenager. Like, a young teenager. How many grenades do you have? Oh, also, Titus is fucking dying. Okay, thank you. Not not very subtle. A girl? That was close. Hey, let me go. Redek Drek. Want me to kill him? It's a little Russian. Motion blur, but it actually makes sense here. Well, thanks for the five gifted subs. And notorious of the abyss with the resub. He has the weirdest sleeve. Are you supposed to be saying something there? Okay. That hurts. Whoa. Okay. Oh boy, near with a tier two reset. Thank you. Oh, it's brother. Kindness. Right, uh, whatever. Do we hood kebeg? Are you a douchebag? I said I don't understand. You better understand. He said you can stay if you make yourself useful. You, you understand me? All right, I'll work. Oh, almost forgot. Using the sphere grid. Select the sphere grid from the main menu. The cursor appears at the selected character's current position. Use the D-pad to move. Defense upgrades, an ability. I have four sphere levels. That means I can move four steps. Sweet. So let's take one step, learn cheer.
So it's like I use... I can put spheres in empty nodes to get whatever I want. Those are activated on the node in the current position in the nodes directly adjacent to it. So if I put a okay, so if I put ability sphere here, I would unlock the ability sphere next. That's right. Now let's look at other useful features. You can look at their stats by pressing triangle. Cheer! Use this information to plan how you wish to upgrade your characters. Let's L1 and R1 to switch between characters. Oh my god! Try improving Tidus now. Okay. Wait, I'm only sphere level one. You said I was sphere level four. You fucking lie to me, game. Same, dude. What? <laughs> Thanks, dude. Bolt! Let's switch primary sub. Oh, another Albed Primer. Oh, why is A? Albed Hujela. What's this? Some kind of crane? Am I going to master the language? I mean, I'll just get whatever right, I find. All right. You don't have to shout. Do we save Rooney? Hey, it's Petit. Thanks for the resub. Uh, where am I going here? We found some ancient ruins right beneath us. Neat. It's not active now, but there should still be some power left. We're gonna go down there and activate it. And then we should be able to salvage the big prize. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's <coughs> get to work. Mm -hmm. Roger. All right then. A bloop. Oh, just like being able to swim wherever you want is kind of cool. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. We'll go as soon as you're ready. Oh, right. Uh, ready. All right, done. A speed sphere. So why this camera angle? Our line heart with five hundred biddies. Done.
Almost there. Hey, gutter snipe, also the hundred bits. Motion blur. Neat computers, beep boop. Slappy slap. Jesus Christ, Titus, it's a computer, not your dick. Stop beating it like that. Darth Fabulous with 100 bits and ship your Dark Wolf resubscribing. Office says your favorite time game of all time deserves a sub. I'll be using Kimari for anything. No, Kimari sucks. <laughs> and just because of Kimari's placement on the sphere grid. Kimari Smarranzo. Camera. Oh, 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 hold on. Oh no! S squid? Got any stuff? Three grenades! Holy shit! Underwater grenade! Oh no, I can't reach him! Certain commands become available in certain battles. Trigger command. Stand by. Hey, bitch. Fuck you. Ah. There any more grenades? Uh, well, maybe. Doesn't say it doesn't have anything, just says couldn't steal. Does he have a rare item? I don't remember anything about steals in this game. Pincer attack. Let's surround him. Person I don't know. This is kind of cool. Whatever. Grenade. Oh, you done it now. Ah. All right. Try not to fuck it up this time. Bullshit! Dude. That's weird. Like, the the way the overdrive works is that... It's more like when you release the button rather than when you press it. And that is a very distinct difference. In the timing of it.
Enemies typically have a rare and common steal. First steal is a decent chance, like 80%, then reduces to 50% further the more times you steal. Just crafting and usable items? I don't remember. That squid had money. Missed Bunny with 200 bits. Love this game, ignoring the post-game grind. I also never used Kamari. No one ever did. All right, so now you got two sphere levels. So now I can be like, boop, boop, move to this location. Use an ability sphere. Ayo, you done learn cheer. Um, can I do anything with Riku yet? Fucking no. All right, so what do you got nearby? It's a real, like a lot much more interesting Riku sphere get it is right away. She can move up and get hit points right away. Or start moving over into... Oh, that's locked. Never mind. Then go to, like, to agility. Or hop around to this. Or level 3 lock. So really top here. Get both hit point upgrades. Move up to agility. Then max... That's a lot of max hit points. Treasure? Oh, we're up, we're, what am I looking at, game? Okay. On the sphere grid, you can learn stuff adjacent to your spot. Yeah. But you need, like, the sphere grid for it, don't you? Do I have any? I don't have any defense grids, do I? Yeah, I just have speed and ability right now, so I can't get Tidus the extra defense at the moment. Professor Barrington, thanks for the Twitch Prime. Bomb. Border Chicken Fry, also resubbing. Thank you guys, I appreciate it. You're a necrid. Yeet, I guess? Like a dog. Alright. Hey! Hey, I helped out, didn't I? No. You should stay out there and freeze. Or drown. Why is everyone being so mean? You're welcome. Whoa! Right on. <laughs> Judy Bear, they get the fifteen hundred bits. It's a big old bitties. Hey. See, it's funny when people eat. Japan humor. It's because you eat too fast. See you, man. Thanks for the tier two resub. Hey. Hello there. What is your name? 
Riku. Whoa! You really do understand. <laughs> Alright, let's calm down. Uh, why didn't you say so earlier? I didn't get a chance to. Everyone thought we were a fiend. Uh, we? Oh, we means you. No, we means yes. And they pronounced um, that differently just earlier, so. Who are you guys anyway? We're out bed. Can't you tell? By our swirly eyes? Wait, you're not an out bed hater, are you? I don't even know what an Albed is. Oh, okay, game. Where are you from? I don't. Zanarkin. I'm a Blitzball player. I... Let me know Star when it changes. player of the Zanarkin Abes. Okay. <laughs> Did you hit your head or something? Um, I'm just gonna write that night down me? now. There are a oh, lot wait. of ass shots. before that? So I told her everything there was to tell about Xanarkin. About life there, Blitzball, and Sin's attack. And about how Aaron and I were engulfed in this light. I just said things as they came to mind. But then I started to wonder. Did I say something funny? You were near Sin. Mm-hmm. Don't worry. Yeah, isn't that You'll sick? Be better in no time. They say your head gets funny when sin is near. Maybe you just had some kind of dream? Mailman, thanks for the reset. You mean I'm sick? Because of sin's toxin, yeah. You sure? Yeah, there is no Xanarkand anymore. Sin destroyed it a thousand years ago. So no one plays Blitzball there. Huh? What, what, what do you mean, a thousand years ago? But I saw Sin attack Xanarkin. You're saying that happened a thousand years ago? No way! So... Oh man, I'm... Gonna have a hard time remembering on the plot, but like Sweet. Sin, who is actually, you know, from a thousand years ago, was like, oh, we gotta do this thing, suck up Titus and Oren so that a thousand years from now they can take care of this whole sin business. But does that mean that they were sinned for a thousand years this whole time? Ugh. I forget exactly what it is. It's just... It's been a hot minute. Remedy! With a Twitch Prime resub. Thank you so much. That full on year! How spoiler you want to get? Uh, not too much, too spoilery. Because there might be people who have not seen this game before, so I'm trying to dance around the subject a little bit. All right, let me actually end this capture clip here. Get ready for the next one. Actually, as that clip exports, I'm gonna go use the restroom real quick. I'm just gonna use the bathroom, everybody. I'll be right back, if you don't mind holding on for just a second. All right, let's get the next clip going. Clip number two. Hit record. Here we go. Hey, Sweet Sweet Gamer with 100 bits. Also gifting a sub. Thank you so much. You play Blitzball? Hell yeah, bro. Uh -huh. Walter Rock's also awesome resubbing. You know, you should go to Luca. Someone might know who you are, or you might find someone you recognize. Luca? Ah. Uh. Huh. <sighs>
Okay, leave it to me. I'll get you to Luca. Promise. <laughs> You'd rather Sweet. stay here? Uh uh. Okay, I'll go tell the others. Wait here. Oh. Why why are the straps like one thing, perfectly crossed don't around tell the anyone boobs? You're from Zanarkand, okay? Yevon says it's a holy place. You might upset someone. Oh, uh-huh. <laughs> like what are those traps doing for you right now? Get Robin Compec also resubscribing. Thank you guys, I really appreciate it. Thanks for being here. Hope you're having a good good day and enjoying the stream. My Xanarkand? Some kind of holy place? Yeah, right, I thought. Since when? Sweet. Kiar Sith Core. Yevon? Twitch Prime. Sin? Luca? I thought Sin just took me to a faraway place that I could go back in a day or two. But a thousand years into the future? No way! Uh -uh. Whoa, whoa! Whoops. Ah, we suck. <laughs> Shin! Shinik Musa! Etonic! Etonic! Motion blur. Up. Oh, here we go again. What's the, uh, what was the relevance of that part? Was that just Sin being like, whoops, didn't mean to drop you off there. Hold on. There you go. Riku. <laughs> Got him. Fucking wrecked, dude. Blitzball. Yay! Everything's gonna be okay. okay. Show him some moves! <coughs> wow, cool! What's over here? Oh, look at that! A moon crest? I can't do anything with that. Dumb. Look how much faster I swim now. God, that's kind of cool, actually. Your PS2 game to go from like above surface to below surface. Treasure? I'll be with you guys in a second. Just gotta. Hell yeah. Rock is my first tanky character. Waka is my. I need to hit that bird character. Razor or all. Oh. <coughs> 
<coughs> excuse me. Treebeard, thanks for gifting five subs. And our KR Sithcore also gifting a sub. Yo. Hiya. Uh, you wanna try that move one more time? Finally. Things were starting to look up. <laughs> <laughs> you know amateur. Who you play for? The Xanarkin Abes. You weren't supposed to say that, idiot. We she just What team you say again? Uh I meant forget that. Uh, I got too, uh, close to sin, and my head's all foggy-like. So, uh, I don't know where this place is. There's a lot of yellow in this game. where I came from. Sin's toxin got to you, but you're still alive. Praise be to Yevon. Guys, want to hear a story? All right, back to practice. When I was working in that game, stop. I'm Waka. Coach and captain of the Visayed Orox brother. Sweet. There's a woman who came in. What? You hungry? Okay, back to the village. I get in a cloak. Like, the hood was down, to be fair, but unabashedly, a cloak. She came in and bought some PS2 game. I can't remember what. But I finished the transactions, finished the sale, handed her the game, and she went, praise be to Yevon, bowed to me, and then left this door. And as she walked away, I remember just still like staring in the spot where she was standing after sta finishing the transaction. And then I, I looked over at the other person who was working with me at the time. And he was also just like, was that real? So. <laughs> to do our best, that's our motto. Guess it's not enough, though. Here, have $200. She was cringe, but you know what? She's living her best life. The best blitzball players, they can hold their breath forever. Thanks for all this stuff. Luna Dog Jones, three sub. Thanks, Luna. Hope you're good. I felt like I could trust this Waka, so I just had to ask. Um, it's true Xanarkin was destroyed, right? A thousand years ago? So it's just a big pile of rubble now, isn't it? Long time ago, there were a whole lot of cities in Spira. Big cities with machina, machines to run them. <laughs> People played all day and let the machina do the work. <laughs> and then, well, take a look. Sin came and destroyed the machina cities. And Xanarkan along with him. Yeah, that was about a thousand years ago. Just like you said. If you ask me, sins are punishment for letting things get out of hand. What gets me though, is we gotta suffer because of what some goofballs did way back when. Oh Plus, man, it's just like global warming now. Sins. That's important. It's just that it's hard to keep at it sometimes, you know? It was just as Riku said. Like they're doing Walker the crossfade thing couldn't with the final frame lying. of the shot. Why would they? <laughs> but you from the Xanarkand Daves, that was a good one, huh? Hey, I'm not saying that team never existed, yeah? <laughs> I'm pretty sure I, I can smell Waka's like armpit. Soft, eh? I appreciated the fact that Waka was trying to cheer me up. But at that time, all I could think about was everything that happened to me. All this, 
started with Sin. Maybe if I could find Sin one more time, I could go home. Yeah, that's how it works. For now, I'd just live life until that time came. No more worrying about where or when I was. Sure, it was hard not to think of home, but I started to feel better already. A little better, maybe. So wondering how Walker got with Lulu? I don't know. Have you never been the subject of a pity fuck? That kind of work. Thanks for the Twitch primary sub. Hey, it's this way. This is a good song. See so, ya. Yeah. Come on. Fuck. Just go up. Damn it. Bum, bum. Bum, bum. Bum, boom. Dun. Da, na, na. Dun, dun. This used to be on my, like, my, uh... This should be one of my chill songs I like to listen to. This is your favorite song in the game? I like this one. I also like Riku's theme a lot. I killed him. Done. You will never speak as Anakin again. What's the big idea? Dun. The Ronso Town song? I don't remember the Ronso Town song. It's been too long for that one. Ah! Don't worry, I beat up this fish. What do you got going on, Waka? Dark attack? Just start off with darkness? Jesus. Yeet! I, okay, but that like ball hitting them sound effect, it's pretty good. Three power sphere? Ananda. Da da. Bum bum. God, that is jarring. Actually, how am I doing on the old spear grid? Can I hit this? Give defense? Not enough to move yet. Sure. Have some defense. Genius' defense increased by one! Waka. Can't really go much here. You can't do shit. All right. God. That's it's just every battle is practically a jump scare. Treasure. Not even like on the ground, just Is it on the ground? Maybe it is. Wait. Uh nailed it. A dun dun Ah, Walkie didn't even kill it. 
I guess you should have had sit the single fish rather than the school. Oh, freaking speed sphere? Okay, so I might be able to get some agility up. Is there anything over here? I hope not, because I can't see shit. Ah, oh, Tia's got a sphere level. That means he can move on the sphere grid. Oops. No. Hold on. Move. Yep. Go dare. Yay! Use power sphere. Plus one strength. Can you backtrack sphere levels and get them back? Huh. You can backtrack sphere levels. Let me go. Got a favor to ask you. Got to kill you, man. You want me on your team, right? Hmm? Just some playful light asphyxiation. A major blitz tournament's coming up. All the teams in Spira will be there. It's so huge. I'm sure someone there will recognize you. Then. You can go back to your old team, right? It'll be fun. What do you say, huh? Come on, come on! Sure thing. Very, very enthusiastic. Dude, our team is gonna rock, eh? Well, we'll see if I get the jack shot. We'll see. I thought then that Blitzball and Sin were the only two things that Spira and Xanarkin had in common. I wasn't too far off either. This is where I was born. I started Blitz when I was five. I joined the Aurochs at 13, 10 years ago. 10 years, and we never won a game. Well, after last year's tournament, I quit. Time seemed right. Oh man, it sounds like time to quit it was ten years ago. Mr. Nylon, thanks for the resub. So, after quitting, I got this new job, yeah? But every time my mind wandered, I thought about the game. Ten years without a single win will do that. Mm. My first match last year was my big chance. But something else was on my mind. I couldn't focus. Nice excuse. Hey, hey! So, you want to win the next tournament? Go out with a bang. So, what's our goal? I don't care how we do. As long as we play our best. That's loser talk. If we give it our all, I can walk away happy. Uh, no, 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 no. If I say, what's our goal? You say... Victory! Uh, Titus is actually right here. In a blitzball tournament, you play to win. Victory? You're serious? One of the, like when doing anything competitive, one of the best things you can do for yourself anytime you make it to like a high level tournament or anything, it's like get rid of that mentality of just like I'm just happy to be here. It's like no, you take each game as seriously as the next, and that's how you improve and get better. So. But he says actually kind of makes sense here. Phoenix Ashes, ah, thank you for subscribing. My third brand new baby sub of the day. Be really uncarved. appreciate the new support. Thanks for being here. Today. After surviving your run-in with Sin, it would be a shame if something happened now. Why was that guy so weirdly well voice acted? Luzu and Gata, Crusaders. Huh? 
cruise of what? What, you forgot that too? Hey, sorry. Don't worry about it. I'll help you out. Cool. In return, come tournament time, I'll make sure we take the cup. Oh. About the Crusaders, you can ask them yourself. They got a lodge in a village. God, the number of times like the camera angle cuts and changes was like fucking playing Devil May Cry. Be saved, village. They got any food there? We'll get you something over there later. Take a look around first. Wait, so Tina's here both like the proxy, the idiot character, and the hungry one? The Crusaders Jesus. Lodge is over yonder. Luzu and Gata are usually there. Hmm. All right. I don't know any prayers. I've never prayed before in my life. Not that he would know that. You must have forgot or something. Here, I'll show you. I also wear one sleeve. Go ahead, you try. Mm. Mm. Why is there one zipper on the back of Titus's overalls? Terrible. Dun, da, 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 Not bad. <laughs> because Nomura is unhinged. You present yourself to the temple summoner. Nomura has gone mad with power. I know that prayer. <laughs> it was the blitz ball sign for victory. My favorite's Lord Olhenya, spitting image of me, old hubby. Fiends are around even during the day. Take care not to travel alone, ya. Yeah? Oh, just gonna ransack this town. But you barely wearing anything. Odd clothes you got. What land you from? This is your first time to Besaid? You're just wearing like an ass flap. My God, sir, ma'am, uh, ma'am. Okay, Jesus, shit. You're the guy for the sea, right? I heard about you from Sir Luzu. Her ass is just hanging out. Jesus Christ. I already thought of a um a bit that I want to do in the Final Fantasy X video. You guys ever hear that old Newground song? That goes like ass, titties, ass, and titties. Ass, ass, titties, titties, ass, and titties. Uh, I'm gonna do that, but it's gonna be me singing, and I'm gonna say ass, titties, ass, and titties. Ass, ass, titties, titties, ass, and titties. Sweet. Cupcake Valkyrie, Hayabusa Hanzo, Moonlight Soldier, all three subs. Dun, dun, dun. I hope the Aurochs don't lose their first match again. I'd like to see them at least tie a game one of these years. I have fucking 19 potions already. I'm good. I'm gonna write that down to make sure I don't forget. Anytime someone says like, um, Final Fantasy 13 is just as linear as Final Fantasy 10, it's like, no, it's more linear. Because at least with Final Fantasy 10, you do get towns like this to kind of break up the pacing, whereas 13 doesn't have those breaks in pacing. Because here I actually get a moment to like just talk to people or explore. 
It's like a... It's like a little, like, bookmark in between just constantly fighting shit. So there's more breaks in between just fighting shit and cutscenes. 13 doesn't have that. Like, honestly, the way it works hey, you, here in 10 is no different than, like, Final Fantasy right? 7, 8, Recently, 9. Was it? I think so. so I'm sorry, they're overload, overworlds, far, but right? it's just like... You're not hiding anything, are you? Why would I? I? If Sin's nearby, it'll attack the island for sure. But it hasn't. I wonder why. I'm sorry. I really don't know anything. To tell the truth, I uh, don't even know what the Crusaders are. You're kidding, right? Sin, the toxin. Gotta tell him who we are. Yes, sir! The Crusaders are sworn to battle Sin. We have chapters throughout Spira, accepting all who wish to join our struggle. The hero Meehan formed the Crusaders 800 years ago as the Crimson Blades. Later, our ranks grew and we called ourselves the Crusaders. We've been fighting Sin ever since. What? You've been fighting 800 years and you still haven't beat it? Uh, uh, uh. Well, we've steered Sin away from towns many times. And that's all we can do. Nobody's ever been able to defeat it. Our mission as Crusaders is to protect the temples, towns, villages, and people of Spira. So, then whose job is it to defeat Sin? Is Sin's toxin really this bad, sir? It does seem rather bad. We could just tell you, but I think it better for you to try and remember. Go pray at the temple. Perhaps Yevon will help you regain your memory. Why isn't this guy like one of the main characters voice actors? He's like, he's actually doing like a really good job. I'd like a nap. <laughs> Complete the snoring noises. Wait. You guys just have this big piece of mocking on this village? Like, just dead ass have this interactive, like, hologram per computer thingy? Aren't you, like, not about that? Oh, sorry. some weaving? As long as I'm around, besides weaving would be known as nothing but the best. Mainlanders, I love the fabrics we weave here in Besaid. Actually kind of cool how they have people moving out, out and about quite a bit, in and out of buildings. Go present yourself to the temple summoner before we eat, yeah? She hot? I mean, I talk about how alive, like, the towns and villages are, but let's face it. None of this holds a fucking candle to Final Fantasy XII. You guys playing? Who are you, mister? <laughs> Ugh, this song. I hope I don't have to hear it over and over again throughout the whole game.
It was then, standing in that place. I began to realize how different this world was from my own. The village was attacked by sin when I was just a little kid, yeah? The village was burnt to ashes. I still have nightmares of that day. Don't bother when they're praying. Against the teachings. Ten years have passed since Lord Braska became High Summoner. And finally, we receive a statue for our temple. Well, what's a High Summoner? Uh, I... I got too close to Sin's, uh, toxin. Ah, <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. Judy Bird with 100 more bits. Thank you so much. It was funny hearing myself make the same excuse over and over. Funny, and a little sad. That's a huge fucking mood. The summoners mood. are practitioners of a sacred art, sworn to protect the people of Yevon. Only a chosen few become summoners, who call forth entities of great power, the Aeons. The Aeons hear our prayers and come down to us. They are the blessing of Yevon. So what he meant... ...was that we should respect some kind of great men, or something like that, I figured. High Summoner Gandalf, not Ga Gandalf, not Gandalf, Gandalf. Give us a blessing and watch over my family. Guys got any loot in the temple? Or like a prayer circle? Or... Summoner's Pilgrimage would make a great kick-ass D&D campaign. I actually kind of agree. Even searching the scriptures of Yevon, I have found no cure for Sin's toxin. May the blessing of Yevon guide you to health, friend. Does Tita stop narrating eventually? Nope. He is t narrating throughout the whole game. And that's the whole point, is that he's basically telling you his story after the fact. Like, this isn't like currently internal monologue. This is like a retrospective think back at everything that happened. Only sworn guardians may approach the Cloister of Trials. Oh, sorry. I'll leave then. Oops, not this one. Hey, dude. Sorry, man. No time for lunch yet. Oh, but nap. so hungry. I'm fine. Or do I have to say yes to move Sorry, on? Man. Okay. Dick. Yeah, I guess he stops narrating it like 98% through. You could at least go see how they are doing. We can't interfere. It's a rule. But it's been nearly. But, but it's, it's been, been nearly. nearly. It's, it's been, been nearly, nearly a day, day already. Perhaps you could go look for us. People, People are, are searching, searching for him now. Is that young Yuna? Thank you. The young Yuna's got some fucking style. Who cares whether he comes back or not? No, that's not. But that's Titus' like mom. That's young Titus. Okay. I couldn't quite Fine, pick up where we were. I mean, she kind of looks like Yuna, though, so that might explain why Titus is into her. But if he dies, you'll never be able to tell him how much you hate him. <gasps> Tell 
you guys remember? No, that Titus really hates his dad. Don't worry, if he comes back, you can tell him how much you hate him. You're encouraging this? Is something wrong? There's Everything, someone, uh, all the time. From the trial. Eh? Well, apprentice summoner, really. Huh? There's a room in there called the Cloister of Trials. Beyond is where the apprentice summoner prays. If the prayer is heard, the apprentice becomes a fully fledged summoner. Remember? Yeah. Uh, so someone is in there somewhere and they haven't come back out. Right, I got it. A day's already gone by. Is it particularly dangerous in there? Sometimes, yes. Why don't you go in and help? There's already guardians in there. Besides, it's forbidden. See ya. Hey, but what if something happens? What if the summoner dies? The precepts must be obeyed. Like I care. Yeah. Maybe. This wasn't such a good idea after all. Oh, I hate these places. Those who seek to learn of Yevon's secret arts are tested by the Cloister of Trials. Find the right way and you will be taken to the Chamber of the Faith. Examine objects with X to open the way. A strange glyph glows. Oh, I remember really not liking these later on. Don't you like? Is it all of them, or just one later run where like you stand on a square and you like, you like shift around or something like that? Neat. Boop. The song gives me Chrono Trigger vibes. You must use this fear to go any further. This spheres are open the way. Destruction spheres open the way to hidden treasure. It seems that Besaid spheres are also necessary. Boop. How long ago was the last time I played this? Uh, about two decades. Give or take. What platform am I playing on? Uh, I'm playing the PS4 HD remaster, but I'm playing it on my PS5. Now, I remember what's worse about this is that... There's not a map? Don't worry, I'll figure it out. Can I take the... Can I take this back out? Yoink. A Glissphere, okay. Are you a Glissphere? Destruction Sphere? And I can place this... Are you treasure? Nope. Um, but then are you treasure? Did I do it? seem right. Yeah, 
Again, it's been a hot minute since I played this. Again, I was talking about the pacing between this and Final Fantasy 13. Like, this is another kind of thing they do to change up the pacing. Is that here, here's actually like a puzzle solving section. Night. Oh. Boop. Treasure? Oh. Squidala guy! Thanks for that $5 GP toss. Congrats on being Final Fantasy IX. Looking forward to Final Fantasy IX. No problem! Besaid Sphere? Who was this one for? My still friends the Normal Boots crew? Yeah, like... We still hang out and play, uh... We're doing, like, Among Us streams and stuff together. Uh... You already got a Destruction Sphere there. And I can use the Besaid Sphere... Do you want the Besaid Sphere? This doesn't seem right. Hold on. I got this wrong. Do I, uh... Oh, maybe in there? That stays open, right? Can I... Take this out? Okay. Take this. Destroy! Sick. Treasure? Hell yeah. Why destruction sphere? Just call them treasure spheres. Okay. So now I think I want to put the Besaid sphere into this one. I know they destroy walls, chat, but I'm just saying, like, I don't know, it seems less... It feels a little less like vandalism, if you call it... <laughs> treasure spheres instead of destruction spheres. No, wait, this is where I, this is where I got the Bisphade sphere? I brought you this. You care? You care? You care a lot? Move the pedestal to set the sphere in the correct place. If you move in properly, step on a shining glyph to return the pedestal to its original place. Okay. This shit's easy. That could be a summoner. It's gotten into you. Hey, it's okay. Hey, Walkie, you're not supposed Only to be in here, remember? Apprentice summoners and their guardians can enter here. Oh wait, now you're good. It's a tradition, very important. So what about you? Me? I'm a guardian. A guardian? Remember when he mentioned his other job, dude? Summoners go on a pilgrimage to pray at every temple in Spira. Guardians protect them. The Guardian's in there now. One of them's got a sure fuse, and who knows what the other's thinking. Well, now that we come this far, might as well go all the way. What are you doing here? Didn't think we'd be able to handle it. No, it's, uh, it's just... 
See, I told you she gets mad easy. Smart Runzo. Is the summoner all right? Who are you? Thank you, Hugger. Not now. You too, Michael Jordan. Calm down. That was just a lion. Also, with the Twitch Prime resub. Man, was I surprised. And here I was thinking summoners were all old geezers. Why does Tears hate old people so much? Ah, oh, right, Japan. Pfft, if they're over 30, stay out of my way, old man. <laughs> Wingy Wingerton, also the resub. Hey, over here. Oh. Oh, oh, hold on. I exited the temple, it's giving me a different camera angle, so it's got me all gibbered. What? Ah, ah, ow! Wait till you see this. Playful choking. I can't ha -ha. see anything. Ready. Okay. When I first played this, it took me way too long to realize that Yuna had different colored eyes. A little screech on. Ow. See, it's a good board. never seen anything like it in my life. Sure, it was a little scary, but still, I could feel a strange kind of gentleness coming from it. Everyone else like thoroughly impressed by Lou's braids? Like, goddamn. I'm just gonna keep all the summon I names remember normal. That night, we talked for the first time. Chloe, thanks for the reset. I didn't know it then, but after that night, everything changed. For everyone. For me. But mostly for me. I'm the important one here. This is my story. Let me introduce you to the team. This guy here wants into the tournament so bad, I let him on the team. His memory's a little fuzzy, so don't mind him if he says anything odd. Come on, say hi. Uh, hi guys. 
<laughs> Hi guys. Do, do our best. <laughs> nope, we got a new goal now. Our new goal is victory. To win every match, defeat every opposing team, to bring the Crystal Cup back to our island. That's all we need to do to win. Easy, huh? So I don't know what victory is. Our victories when our score ties theirs, right? Yeah, I was hoping you'd join the team all along, yeah? Tiger Hawk with resub. Your favorite non MMO Final Fantasy? Yeah, we're not very deep into it. Waka sounds like Bender. That's because he is Bender. Same voice actor. Everyone always says Bender, but... Stay away from the summoner! You're a bad man! Whoa! Lady Yuna, be careful. But it was really my fault to begin with. A kid acting like Twitter. I'm Yuna. Thank you so much for your help earlier. You were significantly shorter than uh, I remember. I'm sorry about that. Wasn't that... Wasn't I not supposed to... Guess I... Kind of overreacted. Oh no, I was overconfident. Um, I saw that Aeon thing. That's amazing. Uh, really? Do you think I can become High Summoner? Lady Yuna, come play with me some more. So, tomorrow then. Tomorrow? We're going on the same boat, aren't we? Oh, really? We can talk more. Huh. Was Yuna like already like this you into can him? Tell me all about Xanarkind. She's cute, yeah? Waka, I don't think you're allowed to say that. You're a guardian? Don't get no ideas. Also, how'd you know no about Xanarkin? No there, big guy. How'd you know about that? Hey, but what if she, like, comes on to me? That's not going to happen. <laughs> you get tired, let me know. I had a bed made for you. Walker well, takes one look at Titus. That's not gonna happen. Doesn't she, like, because of her summoning, or her ascending, whatever, she, like, communicates with the faith? Is that right? From the summoner. Mm, ready for bed. Good. Sleep tight. Oh, playable dream sequence. Hell yeah. Whoop, dreaming about Yuna. So yeah. Is there any stuff in the dream? Nope, just kidding. Oh yeah, I've done that. You remember we having a dream? And you're just like, oh, I don't like where this dream is going. You know what? Reset. Do the dream over. I've done that. Where's that boat? Everyone will find us if it doesn't come soon. You really sure, sure this, this is okay? okay? Would, Would you, you take, take me, me to Xanarkand? Hey! You said what? you'd go with me! What? No, oh, hey, I, uh... You know what, I it's a dream. Weird thing happened. He did? Uh... Yeah, yeah so you're, you're coming, coming with, with me. me. Hey, stop dreaming! You with a woman? You can't even catch a ball! 
Oh, what's the matter? Gonna cry again? Cry, cry. That's the only thing you're good for. I hate you. Huh? What'd you say? You have to speak loudly. We can't hear, little bitch. I hate you. Huh? That's the spirit. You can do it. I hate you! He's dead, okay? Dead. Does Titus have any, like, um, repressed trauma about his dad or anything like that? He does look a lot like Chapu. I was surprised, too, the first time I saw him. But no matter what he looks like, he isn't Chapu. You shouldn't have brought him here in the first place. Yeah, but he needed our help. Excuses again? Yeah, but... That's it. No more. Enough, Waka. Uh. Scary. So, who's Chapu? My little brother, Chapu. He looked like you. He's dead? Gentle, Titus. He Real gentle. The Crusaders when they fought Sin last year. He didn't make it. I first heard on the day of the tournament. Oh, so that's why. I became a guardian to fight sin, yeah? Revenge, then? That was the idea. <laughs> I'm more worried about a stupid game now than avenging my brother. Well, after the next tournament, I'll be a guardian full time. I know it kind of looks like I'm using you, but I'm not. Also, I am. Don't worry. I mean, I owe you a lot. You really... Help me out, you know? What I mean is... Thanks, Waka. <laughs> Stop. You're embarrassing me. We got a different camera angle in the same place I've already been. Do we save a Rooney? I actually kind of want to make a new capture clip because that one went for an hour, which is about right. Uh, let's see, right down on your unit already knows about Titus. Hey, Shadow Walker, thanks, Ledger Bits. Love the new video. Thank you. Appreciate it. Yeah, I mean, I know people like to shit on Waka because, like, the racism. And he hates Albed and uh, Machina and all that. But, like, he's not, like, a bad person, you know? Should you play 10 2? I think so. 10 2 is super fun. But play with a guide, though. Like, you want to play it with a guide. With that clip expert, let's be chill for a second. Walk is a good guy with some religion-based prejudice. Yeah, and like, there's plenty of, lots of people in the actual world who kind of have the same thing. Like, they're actually an alright guy, but like, they kind of have a lot of prejudice and have a lot of, uh, a lot of, uh, 
like beliefs kind of forced upon them, that's kind of making it difficult for them to move on from. Speaking of moving on from though, while we wait for this clip to export, hey oh! Old Man Striker Bold, you have redeemed your chat gold pieces to do a booster pack opening. Again, in case you're new here, you can earn chat GP just by watching and interacting with the stream. And you can spend up, save up those GP to open up a booster pack of your choice. And Old Man Striker Bolt has chosen Mirrodin Besieged. Is this my last one? This is my last Mirrodin Besiege. I have no idea what to expect out of this set because this is when I not didn't play Magic. But we are looking for Mythics. We're all looking for foils. So let's see what we got courtesy of Striker Bolt. Take out the land card token. Let's count the commons. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, number nine, ten commons. Ten total commons, no foil pack. No foil, but we could still get a good rare. Let's find out. All right, your first one common is the Viridian Claw, solid. Uh, Signal Pest, next on common. The Plague Maw Beast. And the rare card that you will open up is... Slagstorm, what is this? One red red for a sorcery. Choose one, deal three damage to each creature or three damage to each player. That's actually kind of rad. For three? I mean, it's sorcery speed, but still. Board wipe or a hateful card against multiple people. I like that. There you go. Slagstorm is the rare that you've been Old Man Striker Bolt. Thank you so much for your chat, GP. Really appreciate it. And now back to Final Fantasy X. And the clip is now exported, which means we can move on to clip number three, hit record, and here we go. Hey, sleepyhead. Something I want to give you. Whoa, you're giving this? Why do you have me? that? Yeah, use it well. That's the sword you gave Chapu. Oh. Well, you never used it. Rip. Copy, thanks for the resub. Where's Yuna? We're taking the same boat as Yuna, right? Why do we gotta wait here? Yuna came to this village ten years ago, when the last calm started. The calm? Since then, she's been like a little sister to me and Lulu. But she had the talent. She became an apprentice. Now, today, she leaves as a summoner. This is our journey. We should leave together. But this is my story. Oh, and she dropped her suitcase already. Aw. You really don't need all that luggage. Sweet. Uh, they're not really my things. Th they're gifts for the temples we're to visit. This isn't a vacation, Yuna. I guess... I guess you're right. Okay, off we go. Oh man. I feel bad for Yuna there. It's weird because, you know, Titus is the proxy character. He's the stand-in, so things are explained to him, so it's also explained to the audience. But at the same time, Yuna is just as, like, inexperienced and, uh, new as Titus is. And, I don't know, I guess I didn't really, didn't really pick up on her unassuredness as I ever really did before. Oh no! Try out that sword I gave you. Okay. Seems good. No problem. Not too shabby. You kept up with him pretty well. Might make a good guardian someday. Oh no! My kind of customer. 
Yeet! A bright arm guard? Arm guard is locker, right? Yeah. Does, uh... Need to remember something here. Oops. equipment not actually give them defense and stuff? That's just a sphere grid, and equipment is just for different abilities? I, I don't fully remember. That looks like trouble. If only we had someone to deal with it! Ha, watch this! <laughs> I'm so cocky! Oh, shit! Told you, only magic can beat that thing. If you can't beat them down, you gotta use magic of an element they don't like. Magic? You sound Element? like you ran out of breath. Let's have our black mage show you what I mean. Lou, you're up. Clueless, aren't you? Good thing I'm here. I feel like ice work well against fire fiends. Thank you. And ice fiends are weak against fire magic. You follow? I get fire and ice, but what about lightning and water? You just lightning and water are opposed, just like you just fire explain it, dude. Ice. This one here is a water fiend. Which okay, means... well, what about earth and wind? Uh huh. All right. What about light and dark? Wait, what type of enemy was he again? Water flame. Got it. I feel like when they made Lulu and just put all their belts down there, it was just them going like, "Hey, cosplayers, fuck you. Good luck." Yeah, cosplayers go challenge accepted. And then they do it anyway. I can never figure out if it actually was just a crap ton Let's of belts. Going, or like belts on top of like wait. fabric huh? or something there to like hold it up. I think it's supposed to just be belts somehow. You ready? What's going on? And I said, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's an ancient custom. People leaving the island pray here for a safe trip. Chapu didn't pray that day. Said he'd miss his boat. That should do it. Oh. This isn't the way to the pier. Oh, well, forgive me for wanting to look around. If you pray, you get less encounters. Oh, but I want encounters. So I get them sphere points. Took you about 25 belts bolted onto pleather. You had to shuffle because it's hard to work. Oh, did you cosplay it? I've already met you. What's going on here? What are you trying to prove a point? 
Yay! Bonk. Captain Moth, thanks for the reset. That's enough. Kimari Kestium. Nah, what's with that guy? Female Hrothgar in Final Fantasy XIV Kimari win? Ronso. Next expansion. The Ronso tribe. He's learned the fiend's way of fighting. That's not what I meant. He's another Yuna's guardian. Huh? <laughs> Sometimes we don't understand him either. Kamari doesn't talk much anyway. Mm. But he has protected me since I was a child. Hmm. Metal shield? What does that do? Plus five percent defense. Sick. What are the gray squares on the map? I thought those were like points of interest or treasure points or is it just weird pillars in my way? Flyer boy. A flyer. That's your department, right? True, true. But uh, why don't we let our summoner show us what she's made of? Switching members during battle. This was always cool. Get the fuck out of here, Titus. We. See ya. Your first real battle. Let's see some style. Show us what your training has taught you, Yuna. Okay. Come, Velafor! Where's my booty? Thanks for resubscribing. Uh, and delay is its turn? Hell yeah. Sonic win! Sonic boom! Now I got two attacks in a row. Ha! She's got 1100 hit points, Jesus. How strong is your black magic? Sonic, boom! So I can do uh, Sonic Wings to delay him, then get an extra hit in there? Hell yeah! Hey, Shane with the resub! What's up, Shane? Oh, that's, that's freaking five years! Dude, Shane, thank you so much for the five years. Thanks for liking the uh, Final Fantasy IX video as well. Seemed like the Noble Boots relaunch went great too. Uh, yeah, we'll hit the delay now. This guy could have done with like half the amount of hit points he has. Fuck yeah. I'm gonna kill the shit out of it.
We just dropped a warrior sword? A lot of hardcore fans in disbelief. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay, so warrior sword is just worse than the Brotherhood. In like every way. Why do you why did you give me this? Sure game. Has Final Play 10 had the best battle system? Uh I don't know about best, but certainly up there. Like Final Fantasy X's battle system is really good. Another one of those. No problem. Leave this one to me, huh? Say good night, birdie. I caught darkness, yeah? I hit him in the fucking eye with my blitz ball, yeah? I mean, like, I could summon, but I'll just defend. Zeke. Oh, she just ran to that rock. The hut is lackluster? I disagree. Might be on the minimalist side, but it's fine. Only displays you information when you need it. Nice crit. Blinding Kate's it? Do they always just drop equipment this often? Like, all right, I guess Moogle's done. Or the blinding Kate Sith. There we go, one for each of us. I kill dog. Ow. Waka kill bird. You kill this guy. I missed a good fat for unit in the temple. I didn't, although I did forget to equip it. Boom. Oh, I'm back to where I was trying to go before. I'm glad you guys liked the Final Fantasy IX videos so much. I appreciate it. I think, uh, I think for the next one, I'm going to do a not Final Fantasy video, kind of in between 9 and 10, just to switch it up a little bit. I only hit Sphere Grid level 1. Oh, RP Walk. It confirmed a lot of our opinions. I mean, that's why people watch reviews anyway, right? Not because they want to be informed or enlightened. They just want their own opinions reaffirmed. Downs. 
Here, a gift from the temple to sanctify her to Petra. God damn. I won't cry, I won't cry, ya! Yeah. They're really leaving. Here, a farewell gift from all the village. Four hundred dollars? Well, Miss Lady Yuna! Take this, Daddy says it's an offering. Damn, everyone's so generous. Do I like the music in this one? In g generally I do, yeah. A lot of the songs I like are like a lot of the not like hype music. Like I like this song, I like Bizet, I like Riku's theme. Like, I think uh, for like chill music, Final Fantasy X does an excellent job. Oh man, there's a... There's an extra weight to these villagers saying, We'll miss Lady Yuna. And Yuna right there saying, Goodbye. Damn. Is this a bit? Why? Dude, what are you doing? Just ask. Dude, is, dude come on. Okay. Anything neat on this boat? Wait, sorry, what'd you say? You want the binoculars? Yes. No way, remember what you did last time? Uh-huh, I looked at Boopa. Oh, that was fascinating clothes you're wearing. Sir? Yeah! Filthy, filthy. These won't sell. All me names, not a waka. Is your name Owaka? Don't look like you got much money either. Hey. I've no business with you. You're right. Anyway. Who do you think you are? Owaka the 23rd. Merchant extraordinaire. Owaka the who? Don't know me? Well, not many do. Not yet. I do not remember this man. Damn. That looks pretty pretty. Interesting that this is actually a pre-rendered background when a lot of the other areas in the game are just actually full models, allowing them to manipulate it. But this is this is a pre-rendered background. It actually looks really good. Is there more stuff up above? Think of it, I haven't told you where we're going. First to Kilika Island. Then we change boats and head for Luca. For that though, Yuna's gotta pray at the temple. I'll be guarding. We'll be praying for the Aurochs victory too, so you come along, yeah? <sighs> great plan. Hey, it is a great plan. Don't look at me.
Word is, that summoner's got noble blood. I heard she's Lord Braska's daughter. You don't say. Lord Braska's daughter? Hmm. Just like all talking with her. Man, I wish we were half as popular as Yuna. Someday we'll earn some respect, just like Yuna. A summoner's confident smile is always a great encouragement to us. Both father and daughter. If anyone can defeat Sin, the, the daughter of Lord Braska can. Please take good care of yourself. Just remember that your well being means a lot to us. I don't know who you are or where you came from. <laughs> All right, good talk. If you interfere with Yuna's pilgrimage, we won't take it lightly. I don't know. If you interfere with oh, you... Oh, got it. So, is Yuna's father famous or something? She's the daughter of High Summon Nebraska. You saw his statue at the temple. Lord Braska defeated Sin ten years ago. There's a stupid fade out again. Yuna's the heir to a great legacy. Redwall, thanks for the resub. It's tough <sighs> when your father's famous. Huh? Walker's a bit lacking in the imagination department. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Thanks, Lulu. I'll keep that in mind. Wow. Not even subtle, Lulu. Waka's dumb and slow. Don't use big words around him. Core flexing the hundred bits. Hey, can you believe this? What? I just saw this merchant guy inside the ship. Guess what he said to me? He walked up to me and said, You're no good, just like that! Isn't that awful? I've still got style! I'll show him. Yeah. I knew I was right. He doesn't know what he's talking about. Is the walker just gonna be like fashion police up in here? I don't know. Oh, still the same things. Okay. All right, man, I'll bite. But someday, the name of Walker will be spoken all over Spira. Say, lad, you wouldn't have a bit of gill to lend. Sure. I have 1,200 gill. Whatever. I guess it pays to ask. Thank you kindly, lad. Fine seed money for the Owaka Merchant Empire. Please don't call it seed money. <laughs> I'm not okay with that. He seems real sick, yeah? I'm hiding over here because I'm gonna get sick too if I keep watching him. If you see one guy throw up, you sort of get sick too, you know? Fuck you. Piece of shit. Why does Tina's hate suitcases? Fucker. Piece of shit. I think I'm gonna hurl. People don't say hurl anymore, do they? Is that kind of like outdated vernacular? That seems like very like late 90s, early 2000s. Oh man, I'm gonna hurl. Kind of like. I don't know. I'm not at liberty to talk about our plan. If people think you're with us, you'll be excommunicated too. Some things you're better off not knowing. Take it from me. Restricted area. Our operation depends on this cargo. Why don't you go topside? The fresh sea breeze might help restore your memory. Power room. 
Oh my god! What the heck is that? What, what the heck is what? What is this place? The power room, like it says on the door. Yeah, but why the big birds? What's so strange about chocobo power? We hate chocobos. machina. Chocobo Those only. Chocobos? What? You've never seen a chocobo? What kind of backwater island did you come from, anyway? Hmm. That's Miracles right. and oddities were starting to become daily routine on this trip. It's chocobo. F you, everyone who says chocobo. La, 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 la. I don't remember that. La, 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 la. All right, if you got chocobo emotes, now's your chance. La, 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 la. No. Good chicken horse. Is it this boat? Tia's comes out at night. Should I practice kick passes too? Yeah. Okay, I'll pretend I'm kicking with my hands. We don't stand a fucking chance. He's really bad at kicking. Thank you, Miles, for the $14 chuckabo donation. Oh yeah, you talked to Uni yet. She had some questions for you. Next boat is night boat. Okay, thank you. On the way to Luca, not Kilika. Got it. Who's hotter, Kuja or Seymour? Oh, Kuja is. I was not someone who ever thought Seymour was hot. Although I was talking to Lady Pelvic about it. And she was someone who's like, no, Seymour is hot. And I was like, what? I don't remember that. So, the wind. I'll see nice. if I change my mind upon another playthrough. Mm. Mike Castaldo makes the fourteen dollars. Blitzball player, aren't you? From Xanarkin, right? Uh, you hear that from Waka? Mm hmm. Huh. Did she say Waka. yes? She lied. Waka doesn't believe me at all. <laughs> but I believe you. Huh? I've heard in Xanarkin there is a great stadium all lit up, even at night. Huh? Great Blitzball tournaments are held there, and the stands are always full. How do you know that? A man named Jack told me. He was my father's guardian. What? Jack. My father. His name is Jack. <gasps> Amazing! Hmm. You know, our meeting like this must be the blessing of Yevon. Mm. Sounds like him, but it can't be him. Why not? My old man, he died. Ten years ago, off the coast of Xanarkin. I I'm sorry. Weird, the Jack I knew died ten years ago. For training one day, and never came back. And no one's seen him since then. 
Why, that's the day that Jekt huh? came to Spira. But... Uh... It's true, I first met Jekt ten years and three months ago. I remember that was the day my father left. The date fits, doesn't it? The... The... <laughs> yeah, but how would he get here? You're here? Are you not? <laughs> oh, shit. Third house for the resub. Oh no. We're at the sea. We should have known the dungeon master is gonna force sea encounters upon us. I don't remember Yuna's boots being so freaking styling. Oh, I got him. All right, now it's your plan. Kimari doing here? Kimari, get the fuck out of here. Should probably start taking some of these guys out. Wings start to flicker. That's bad, right? Ye Crit him! Holy shit, Waka! Fuck harpoons! Let's Waka's dodgeball get him. Okay, that's Miles. Thanks for gifting us up to Jesus the Dio. That's a lot of damage. Kind of want to prevent that from happening again. Mmm. More like free AP. How many of these things are there? The Finn! Attack the Finn! Fighting at a distance. Yeah. 
Oops, come on. Get everyone some defense. Uh, I kind of like how they do, like, some kind of dynamic fights, like this things are moving around and all that. Uh, I think that's cool. Yeet. Still not have to one shot it. Bink. There we go. Kate Sith, good job. Catches it every time. Age of Gil Popery with the resub. Should probably just cheer again. We. Pricey 666 also with Twitch Prime. My fourth brand new baby sub of the day. Thank you so much. Ow. Actually, starting to get low and healthier. It's fine. I'll handle it. Oink. You got the glowy bit, so boop. Grab out Ina you know, real fast. Uh, I guess Walker, because I think Titus has more hit points. Victor really with 100 bits. What place is my top 10 Final Fantasy is 10 in? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Whoop. And he's dead. Rip. Screeches. That's an intense boss delay. Pew! Almost got him. Just using Valifor to take some hits. All right, boss has got six hit points. Kill him! Is 13 really that bad story-wise? 13 is that bad everything-wise.
Oh, oh, getting, okay, just die, just dying. He's just dying. Just getting sliced up. Underwater blitz ball. Got, got him? It's a blitz ball, not Captain America's shield. Oh shit, dolphins! Uh, do we fear those? Oh no, that thing we fear. Got it. Wait, did they keep coming? I don't remember. Cheer again. Jesus Christ! There we go. Yep, they just keep coming. Okay. You're blind. Does this help? It does not. I really appreciate how fast and snappy this combat is, especially after playing Final Fantasy IX. What? Okay. Just give me that overdrive. Keep my hit points up a little bit. Is there like a lore explanation as to why they breathe underwater? It's because they're Blitzball players. It's supposed to be like, they've trained so hard to play underwater and breathe underwater that they just have really good lungs. So like, canonically, yeah, it is kind of explained. I'm gonna fuck this up, ready? Fuck. First try. Oh, overkill? Hell yeah! Blue armlet and liquid steel? Just more stuff? I'll be okay. Oh. Uh... I actually wonder how much the developers kind of took inspiration from like the real life tsunamis that frequently hit Japan and kind of used that to. Makes scenes like this much more real and that more 
upsetting and terrifying. The only survivor. The Blitzball. When Sin attacked Xanarkin that day, I woke up in Spira. I kept hoping it would work in reverse, too. I will defeat Sin. I must defeat Sin. I was just fooling myself. Maybe it was that day, on the sea, under the burning sun. I started to give up hope. I was in a foreign world. I wasn't going home. This was my new reality, and I was stuck in it for good. Hey Switchblade, thanks for the resub. When I grow up, I want to be a Blitzball. Greetings. I am the summoner Yuna. I have come from the temple in Besaid. Oh, Milady Summoner. If there is no other summoner here, please allow me to perform the sending. Ah, thanks, BT. Our loved ones. We feared they would become fiends. Please, take me to them. We'll go see what we can do to help in town. Huh? Eh? Do save her, Rooney. Hey, you're alive. Wait. What do you want? We're not open. Okay, shop for later. Got it. The pub's closed. I don't think I can get through this without a drink. That is called a problem. Do you just watch your step? It's not safe this way. Look at them going like straight into repairs. Does it go straight into the summoning part? Uh, what's ascending? Are we going somewhere? <sighs> you truly are clueless. Are you sure it's just your memory that's the problem? No, I got a lot of problems. The dead need guidance. Filled with grief over their own death, they refuse to face their fate. They yearn to live on and resent those still alive. You see, they envy the living. And in time, that envy turns to anger, even hate. Should these souls remain Fade. in Spira, they become fiends that prey on the living. Sad, isn't it? The Sending takes them to the Far Plane, where they may rest in peace. Summoners do this? Hmm. Final Fantasy games starting with, like, 
7 actually started doing like a pretty good job at establishing why there are monsters in the world and where the monsters are coming from. That still looks great. It must be tough, being a summoner. Yuna chose her own path. She knew from the beginning what it meant. Hydrate. All we can do is protect her along the way until the end. Until the end? What's the end? Duh! Guess I said that a little loud. Until she defeats Sin. Oh. I hope... I hope I did okay. You did very well. They've reached the far plane by now, but no tears next time, hmm? Uh. I wished there would never be a next time. No more people being killed by sin. No more sendings for Yuna. Everyone stood there watching her. It was strange, and somehow, horrifying. I never wanted to see it again. I like that she, um... Looks for like acceptance slash guidance from Lulu. And I like older sister kind of way. That's nice. I'm gonna be a blitz ball when I grow up. Not a player. Just a blitz ball. What? I know <laughs> I know my lot in life. I don't want to aspire for too much. Just a blitz ball. Wee! That's actually a good place to uh get a new capture clip going.
the, the Blitzball did survive the attack. And that Blitzball is strong enough to defeat Sin. Or at least Sin's Finn. So. You live your dream, kid. Don't let anyone stop you. I'll let that capture clip export. I'm gonna go out the beaten path with anyone for the sphere good. Uh, it kind of depends. We'll see how much sphere points I actually get and what unlocks I do. Kid is a surprisingly upbeat for two thirds of his village dying. Haste was super OP. It was super OP. Haste was really good, especially when you got like the damage limit break or whatever it's called. While we wait, if anyone's new here, don't forget, you can always join the Discord. This is my first time playing Final Fantasy X? Nope. I've played it before. It's just been two decades since I've played it, so I don't exactly remember everything. Which character is worse, Lulu or Kimari? Kimari. By a lot. Okay, that clip is now exported. We can move on to the next. Keep recording gameplay footage. Is there a Final Fantasy that I haven't played? That doesn't consist of 1 through 15? No. 1 through 15, I've played all of them. I mean, for here I'm out, the only one I never finished was 15. Including the MMOs? Yeah, I played the MMOs. <laughs> Is the pub open? Hell yeah. Hook me up, brother. All the food and drinks are at the bottom of the ocean. Uh, it's like that. I don't care if there's any. F there isn't any food. I just want to stay here. If 
find out that the MMOs are considered numbered entries instead of being called Final Fantasy Online? Well, originally it was going to be called Final Fantasy Online. But then the story they made for Final Fantasy XI was so legit, they realized, no, this is, there's enough single player stuff, enough plot stuff here that we can call it Final Fantasy XI. Am I supposed to be able to... Rod of Wisdom, what's equipped? What does... Can I see what this ball provides? Or is it just... Okay. I can't tell if Scout is better than Official Ball. How do I... Hold on. Liquid Steel! It does give Water Strike. Yeah, fishball does nothing. Ooh, plus ten percent hit points. Smaller round show. Okay, so upper right is the equipped abilities, and lower right is the. New abilities. I was just trying to figure that out. There we go. Okay. Seeker shield gives more hit points. Seeker's ring is worse than the... How is this Seeker's ring? She has super Seeker's ring? Okay. Dark ward versus hit point up. Uh, this is just better for Lulu. Temple, where we pray for victory. Go! High Summoner O'Hallan used to live in the Kilika Temple here. Yep, Lord O'Hallan was once a great blitzer, you know. Waka. Hmm? Praying for victory is all good. Uh, but is this right? Something wrong with enjoying Blitzball? Is this really the time? This is the only time. The players fight with all their strength. The fans cheer for their favorite team. They forget pain, suffering. Only the game matters. That's why Blitz has been around for so long. At least that's what I think. Whatever you say. Let's play and win, right? Right. Temple's beyond the jungle there. Let's go. I feel like this shows, it says a lot about this world in that um you know big chunk of the village just got destroyed and walks is like all right let's go pre the victory guys and uh tita's like hey is this really the time a lot of people just died and walk is just like uh oh, this is the only time what are you talking about but she's just kind of showing like the whole living with sin and sin destroying everything is just like it's just a known fact and the world doesn't come to accept it and it's just a um it's like, this is just how it is. All right, let's move on. Really can't do much about it.
What's up? Yuna is saying she wants you with us. Huh? Sick. I I'm in. To ask you to be my guardian. You know what? This is no time for jokes, yeah? He may be a blitzball whiz kid, but up against fiends, he's a newbie. So Not were you at some then. point? I just want him nearby. Well. What? What do you mean? It's just that... Well... We're all going to the temple anyway. Can't this wait till later? Uh, Lulu with the save. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have... There's nothing to be sorry about. I'm just not really sure what's going on. My apologies. Look at that fucking guy. Something is written here. Kamari, what the fuck do you think you're doing? Why don't you use Lancet on it? Ugh, that's What's why. What's a Lancet? Normally, it's a skill that weakens enemies and heals the user. But when Aronso uses it, that Ronso can sometimes learn Fiend's abilities. Hey, sounds cool. All right. I learned Seed Ganon. Kill it. Oh, uh, do you want me to run so rage? Seed Ganon. <laughs> Got him. Kimari's a blue mage? Yeah, he's a blue mage. Oh, Tidus has got two levels of spear grid. So where can I move him up to? Up to here? Whoop. This teaches flea. That's dumb. I have a point of agility! Do I really want flea? Like, I guess. So I can move Lulu all the way to here, get her MP up, and this. Vision by two points? Hell yeah. And some extra magic points, which she needs. Uh, you know, it's also got three points. Get her all the anti element spells. All right, Waka is here. Boop, 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 boop. All right, more hit points. Two more points of agility. And then I can give him like more magic points, but he doesn't really need magic points that much, but also like, I don't know, what else am I gonna use these on? Which is worse if you're good at Crystallium? Oh, Crystallium is absolutely worse. Like, not even a question. Aw, oh, Scout Ball! I just... I just paid money for that! 
Take it easy, huh? I'm fine. Too bad. Thanks. I see nothing yet. Damn, we're actually getting hella poison steel. Good God. Just constantly dropping stuff. How hard was this monster thing in the middle? Like, can I get away with fighting it? Focus on the fight. No worries. I should attack A. Fuck. I could probably manage. All right. Did I just hit the wrong one? Sure did. Nice dodge. Oh, I did get it. Okay. This should kill him? Not quite. Waka, overkill. He's got eight hit points. Do it! Not even overkill. Fuck. Ba -ba -ba -da -boom. There we go. Actually, get a lot of sphere grid ups. Freaking like finally. Potion up. Oh. Didn't mean to bump into it, but here we are. Is this an Ochu? Lord Ochu, four thousand hit points. Uh oh. Uh. All right, here we go. Guess we doing this. Immune to dark. That's too bad. Uh. I'm gonna keep cheering. Ah, oh, Waka. Little bit of dodge, good. Walker's just staring at Titus as he was doing that and it looked really weird. Oh, poison's like no joke in the damage department. Oh, you cast water? I can null that. I get a fucking second here. Yeah, let's get rid of the poison with an antidote, let Yuna heal. Could bust out Balafor just during like delay shots. Keep cheering! When you swap them out, their uh, stat ups go away. Fuck. It's 
Stand up, stay? Okay. Uh, oh, I don't have no water or whatever it's called. Damn it! Right inside your mouth. Yeet. Block. Oh, that's not good. I guess I could have just swapped out to Yuna, but I kind of think I would need Titus's damage right now. Between Titus and Lulu, like, they're keeping constant deeps on him. Block out. Not hitting as hard as I thought he was going to. Lord Ochu falls asleep. Fantastic. There you go, man. Here. Oh, he's healing like a lot. Holy fuck. Frost Shaggy with the resub. Thank you so much. Wake up. Stop healing. Oh boy. go. Plus the delay? Yeah, that's the strat. Sonic rings delay him a turn. Oh, apparently overdrive slows him down by a lot. Three actions in a row? That's too much. Let's keep using fire. But now getting low on hit points. Uh, delay, then overdrive? Hey, DB, thanks for that 100 bits. Laser beam! He flipped! Then he goes ape shit, kills Bella 4. And we back. This might kill him? Yep. All right, first try. Never not had it. An alert bangle, an MP sphere. Whoa. I know. A summoner and her guardians. Very impressive. Sir, we should fight too. We'll get our chance soon enough. Young Crusaders gather around. We'll be singing to the crowd. Whoop. All right, Titus, you need yourself some uh, accuracy. And then, like, I guess magic? I don't know. You know, only got one more point. But this is enough for her to go get bar water or whatever it's called. Not water. I'm down to melt tide. 
I only have six ability spheres left. I should probably chill on those a little bit. Plus two magic. Plus two magic defense. Plus two evasion. Waka can get his magic up. That seems really dumb for Waka. Silence deck, yeah. Like, why would I want to increase Waka's magic? Does that, does that improve the damage on his, like, Dark Ball and shit? Because all this seems dumb. Who's thicker, Lulu or Yuna? I don't think you really know what thick means. He gets drained later. I guess. I suppose it's not so early enough that I got plenty of these to spare. Does it increase the chance of the status of X proccing? Oh, I have no idea. Yuna! Aeon! Just who do you think you are? He is trying to tell Yuna what to do. <gasps> no, your role, sir. Let us guardians handle the likes of these. I can take care of those alone, huh? Take that. Punk. An easy win, yeah? Increases magic, also raises magic defense. There are separate stats. Treasure? Two mana spheres. Sick. On one brute with the reset. Enjoyed the Final Fantasy IX video? Thank you. Glad you liked it. So these guys take less damage from water, so... This doesn't have... Water damage on it, does it? Now what? Your fucking job. Do it. God, Walker, you suck. I can't even kill him. Yeah. Oh, this murdered you, Lulu. <laughs> Straight up. God damn. Please don't hit her again. There we go, walk a dodge. I don't think we're gonna be able to kill him before he gets another attack, so we'll heal up Lulu with a potion. So that Tidus can get us whacking. Speaking of, Tidus is getting low on hit points, but a Lulu fire should finish him. There we go, no problem. I should probably make sure Yuna's getting into battle so she can actually get some ability points too. I thought it was uh I thought they got it no matter what, but I guess not. Out of my way. Ha! Big crit. Shazam. God damn it. What's your overdrive again? Fury? You didn't need to do that. Swap to Yuna. I'm ready. Yuna stick hit. Oh, kind of thought that would kill it. Uh oh. Uh, shit. Probably should swap back to Tidus and didn't know that swing. Oh, good dodge, Lulu. That would have been bad. Here. Sorry.
So look at this whole area. At least like I have different pathways to check out to find loot. 13 doesn't even have that. Can I hit that? Uh, fucking barely. I don't remember. Does Yuna need to do an action here in order to get points? Or can I just swap her out? It is an action. That's what I figured. All right. Eh. That would make sense, because otherwise you can just, like, swap them out infinitely. Anyone thirsty? Lulu, you can't say that. You can't say that, Lulu. Oh, yeah, I guess I could just defend. Oh, this is the correct path. I'm gonna go back then. Yeah. I can throw a cure on Waka. I guess I could get Kimari some frickin' ability points, just so he's not completely worthless later. <sighs> He'll still be worthless? Yeah, but he has a... He has, like, the forced fight that you gotta do with the Ronso tribe, right? So, like, I might as well get him something. Hope I make it to the tournament. Ooh, Jesus. You called? That didn't even kill him? Jesus Christ. Yeah. The difficulty of the force bite scales to Kamari's level? Oh, I don't think I knew that. Alright, well then fuck him. Hell yeah, dude, a Lux Spear? That shit's hard to find. Oh, this scout's better than this scout. What the fuck? I don't remember those being like different or random or whatever. Did I see the previews for the D&D set for magic? I did. Is it just me or is Loth like bad? Also, I don't give a fuck about Drizzt and nothing wizards will ever do will make me care about that character.
Oh, they lean right off. Just defend. Just don't die. There's the overkill, finally. Just found regular ass staff. Does, um. Alright. Does it do that thing where. The AP is split and reduced for each character that comes in. Like, evenly split amongst them. Like, if three the characters get 20 AP, history, you know. if I bring in a fourth character, they all get 15? Or is it just like, if I bring in a fourth yep. character, they also get 20? Hundred percent to everyone. All right, cool. <laughs> the fuck was that about? A race, huh? <clears throat> Think you can beat me? <laughs> Yuna, if you would. Uh, ready? <laughs> hey! hey. Ah, Shit! Huh? Hey! You are losing. <laughs> Kids. <laughs> oh, fuck. All right, well, now nah, I'm not gonna confuse myself. Everyone, quick, sin spawn. Lulu can move incredibly fast despite all those belts in her dress. Ha! What? Oh. Vulnerable to magic. Or magical attacks. So these guys just gotta die. Immune to blind, though. Fuck. Alright, so you can't do anything yet, unit, uh, Lulu, so you might as well get the fuck out of there. I said you're vulnerable to fire? means you'd probably use water magic or ice magic maybe yo you know with the two turns in a row Double hit on Waka. Yeah. Kill it. You didn't do shit for damage. I just need to teach us to shear. Uh, I can move you out of the time. At least reduce one of their attacks. Nice dodge. Does this work? Hell yeah, get silenced. My can't hurt it either. How about magic? Still seem to be doing okay on hit points. Not until we kill it. Oh, big crit. Might not kill it. Oh, unless he crits. There we go. 
All right, silence did not stop Sai. Cure Titus. Oh, it's got this special already, though. Here, we'll do a cheer. We'll swap out Yuna for Lulu. Open up. No? Do you not? It's hard as rock! My sword's no good! Open up. Sir? Ah, that's a lot of damage. Alright, fine, you fuck. What could you make me do? Oh, oh, uh. I forgot what I was supposed to do. God damn it. I mean, that's so terrible. Come on, fire. Fuck. Fuck. Up. I don't think, uh... What about now that you're open, idiot? Nope, still immune. Motherfucker does cast water. Shit. Alright, well, I'll kill it. about that. Hope to break you in a little slower. B being a guardian's tiring. You handle yourself pretty well. You got talent. Nah. So, what are these sins spawn anyway? Fiends. They fall from Sin's body and are left behind in its wake. Leave him alone and Sin comes back for him. You gotta be quick. That moment when Waka told me I had talent in battle. I think that was when I started seriously considering becoming a guardian. Like you aren't already? Twilight Steel. That sounds neat. Is it good? Dark Touch? No. Track speed? Plus some hit points that he desperately needs. Oh, changing an empty node to a luck node? I, I think the first time I played this, I saved most of my luck spheres for Riku. Oh, I just realized this is the dead end. Whoops, I need to go back. Fucking rip. I'm an idiot. Alright, we well, already fucked that up. Good job, me. Alright, more magic points for Yuna is good. She also has more, was that defense? Yeah. 
Kamari, you can fuck off. Wakra. Get you to that strength and accuracy. Whoop. Plus two damage. Plus two accuracy. Lulu. Moving through nodes you've bought is free. I thought it was one sphere level lets you go back four. I don't remember it being free. Lulu submit points. More magic defense. More magic attack. Well, since I moved him here, I might as well, like, get something out of it. Luck plus floor! Holy shit! Oh, I don't have anything to shove into it. Oh, fuck. That was a goddamn waste. Whoopsie doodle. I'll be back. Whoops. Huh. So it's luck spheres to change them to empty, but you need a different sphere to activate it. So, uh... They got fiends in Xanarkand, too. Just a few. It's a big deal when one shows up, though. Uh... Hey, since one of you believe me about Xanarkand anyway? I've been thinking. Maybe people Sin gets to don't die. Maybe Sin carries them through time. Like a thousand years through time. And then one day, maybe they just pop back, see? That explains it. Amazing. Simply amazing. Hmm? You make up one theory after another, refusing to face the simple truth. Well, you said he had no imagination, Sin so... Sin didn't take Chapu anywhere. Sin crushed him and left him on the Jose shore. Holy shit, Your Lou. brother won't just pop back. Damn. Oh, and one more thing. No matter how much you want it, no one can take Chapu's place. No one can replace Sir Jekt, for that matter. And there's no replacement for Lord Braska. Either. God damn, it's Lulu! to think about it, and sad. Stop being such a worthless loser, or sometime in the future I'm gonna smash I, your dick. I could never be what Chapu was. Well, stuff happens. Best not to worry. Waka, Lulu, and Waka's brother, Chapu. Something had happened between them a long time ago. I was sure of it. Well, whatever it was, it was none of my business, that's for sure. Best not to go there. Hello. Climbing those stone steps every day has kept me in shape. Haven't caught a cold in years. I'm gonna pray real hard so that sin doesn't come back here. I have to do a whole thing in here. Oh, shit. You here to pray for victory, too? Us pray? Oh. Who needs to pray? The Luka goers always win. What's up, Gary Oak? Oh, yeah? Then why are you here? We've been praying for some competition this year. So what's your goal this time? You gonna do your best again? Ha! It's too bad your best isn't good enough. Why even bother showing up? This time, we play to win. Hmm. Ooh, play away. Just remember, even kids can play, boys. See huh? the finals. What are you implying there? We'll I know these guys are just being dicks and walk us. It's like, these are my friends. You know that team? Putting people down. They're as bad as my old man. But... Sir Jekt was a kind and gentle man. 
Well, not my ject. Uh... Even ten years after he left, just thinking about my old man got me angry. <laughs> but maybe that was just my way of keeping him... Nah. Nah. I think Waka needs to do a little more praying. I'd say so. Please, let Waka's prayers be heard. Please. Lord O'Holland, guide our feet. Sure, man, I'll join. Hey. A summoner, are you? My name is Yuna, from the Isle of Besaid. Donna? So, you're High Summoner Braska's daughter. That's quite a name to live up to. My, my, my. And all these people are your guardians? Mm, people. Are rabble. As I recall, Lord Braska had only two guardians. Quality over quantity, my dear. <laughs> Whatever were you thinking? I have need of only one guardian. Right, Bartello? <clears throat> I only have as many guardians as there are people I can trust. I trust them all with my life. To have so many guardians is a joy. And an honor. Even more so than being my father's daughter. Of course, I would never think of questioning your ways either. So, Lady Donna, I ask of you, please leave us in peace. You do what you want, Bartella, we're leaving. Kill him with politeness. <sighs> Got him. A guardian is someone a summoner can rely on. Someone she can trust with her life. I wondered, did Yuna feel that way about me? What's she smiling about? Yeah, that was a, that was a really polite way of just being like, stay in your lane! is below. Let's do it. The faith? But first, the cloister of trials. Kamari, Waka, ready? Strength, everyone. No. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what gives? Kamari. You're not a guardian yet. <laughs> um... We'll be back as soon as we can, okay? Oh, sure. Soon. Like, tomorrow soon, I bet. Really cool how Titus wears his hoodie inside out so you can see the tag. Like I give a fuck. Where's Yuna? What are you doing here? Then why are you here? Hey, I'm not a guardian, so I'm not supposed to go in, right? Hmm, not a guardian, you say? When was the last time I played this? Around when it came out, so <laughs> Hey, I... wait! Two decades ago. Uh, ah, let me go! You're gonna get me in trouble! Go! What's a big idea? Just a little game. Huh? 
Lady, I can see most of your ass. This is bad. Really bad. Only guardians allowed. And I'm sure no guardian. Well, I guess it's too late now. All right, not one of these guys, huh? This is a fire spear, a Kalika spear. That's a Kalika spear, not a destruction spear. So did like did Yuna not do this? So yeah, put that spear there, put on the glyph, return the flame spear. Or is this gonna make the flame show up again? Fuck, never mind. Oh wait, there are side ones here. There we go. Hey, kill the killer, thanks for the resub. That there. Take this one. With the glyph sphere with the glyph. What? The glyph repels me! Fuck. Can I push this one? Set. That's a Kilika sphere, which I can take. Oh, stop. Glyph spear. Other Kilika sphere. Can I put put that in there? Which makes a little torch. Take the glyph sphere and then put that into it. Ah, there we go. A destruction sphere, sick. That also made the flames go away. Imagine I can put the destruction to one of these bad boys. Not that one, though. Take the flame out of this one. Put that back where I found it. And then move the destruction one to the wall on this side.
No? Or do I want to hold on to the destruction sphere, reset it, and then put it into the wall here? Okay, just kidding. Is there another one down here or something? Take that. Nope. A little, little like pathway on the wall floor is kind of goes into that. Oh. All right, let's go drop this one off since, you know, I've only got two hands, so I can only carry one at a time. Oops. I imagine Kilika's Sphere opens that up. Right. Anything in here? Did they put a burning one there? Can I push you down steps? Come on. Nice push, idiot. Come on. Fuck. Fuck. Please. Oh, oh, oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> now. Nope, just kidding. Cannot push it downstairs. Okay. So that... That resets it? Ah, oh, just push the fucking thing, dude. Oh my god. Can I push this on the flashy boy? I thought flashy boy only reset it. Allows me to take that out. Put that guy back there. Destroy that one. That do anything for you? Yeah, give me treasure. 
Red armlet? Who's that for? Ah! Kamari! Damn it, why'd I do that? Fuck. Sup guys, how's it going? I'm here too. Whoa, whoa, whoa! It was Donna and that big muscle head man. Yuna will be the one to suffer the consequences. Uh, what consequences? She could be excommunicated. The chamber beyond is a sacred place. Only summoners may enter. What? Even guardians can't go? It's taboo. Oh. Wow. Oh. Not gonna tell me the same thing, are you? Just wait. Chaos so Consortium, they the reset. Anyway. One year! The faith, remember? Oh yeah. That thing, right. The faith are people who gave their lives to battle sin. Yevon took their souls, willingly given from their still living bodies. Huh? Now they live forever, trapped in statues. But when a summoner beckons, the souls of the faith emerge once again. That's what we call an Aeon. All that in this room? Neat! So, so, what's Yuna doing in there? She prays with all her heart for a way to defeat Sin. Kamari, your thoughts? <gasps> okay. Just wait. No, oh, I'm bored. <gasps> <gasps> Sorry. There was something I didn't tell anyone else that day. That song we heard there, in the temple, I knew it from my childhood. It was proof that Spira and Xanarkin were connected somehow. At least to me it was. Maybe that's why suddenly I felt like I just wanted to go home. Double I tried to say news. something to tell them, but the words wouldn't come. Fuck yeah, dude. Ifrit? Do you, chat, do you pronounce it Ifrit or Ifrit? I've heard it both ways. I've always liked Ifrit more. Hey, guys. Kilika Temple is the Temple of Fire. Even the Cloister of Trials is engulfed in flames. Okay, so I've gotten wind and I've gotten fire so far. So I still need to do water and earth. Got it. I've always pronounced it I free well that's just outright wrong. How dare you? I ignored the precepts and went into the cloister once. Boy did I get in trouble. My mommy and daddy are at a place called the Far Plain. They're dead. Lady.
Oh, I remember when I used to have crowds of people. I remember when I was liked. Me too, Titus. I thought I had put my feelings for Xanarkin behind me. But they were there, and they grew inside me bigger and bigger, till I was just about ready to burst. Are... are you okay? I... I don't know. What do you want to do? To scream real loud? <laughs> Good voice directing there. Ba 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 ba. Yeet. Fucking wreck, dude. Judy Burb, resubscribing. You missed, bitch. Ha! Oh no, I've been covered in seed. Kinda wanna make sure Yuna gets a little bit here. All right. What purpose did overkill serve again? If you overkill, you get a bonus in AP after the battle. I forget exactly how much. But it's actually like an experience bonus. All right, I'm gonna whip that clip. Finish up. Save the game. Sweet. Do some notes. Some more temple puzzles. Thank you so much for getting five subs to the chat and how for the dwarf resubscribing. Thank you guys. Oh, doing a stretch. Actually, I'm gonna need to use the restroom again if you don't mind, chat. While the uh, the capture clip exports, I will be right back. Keep it right going. Oh, farm cat, thanks for gifting out some subs. Also, I missed your donation earlier. Thanks for that. Did I ever make it to my PO box? Not lately. I will, I swear, I just haven't. People are, uh, digging the Final Fantasy IX video, which makes me very happy. It's actually performing slightly better than the Final Fantasy VIII video, which is great. Because, um, I was surprised that the Final Fantasy VIII video did as well as it did. I was fairly certain. I basically was at a moment where I was just like, I'm fucked by YouTube. Like the YouTube algorithm has just like completely shut me out of getting any kind of views or showing to uh, subscribers. The Final Fantasy VIII video did surprisingly well, and this one's currently performing like 10% better, give or take, which is just surprising, but also kind of comforting. Which is good. Oh, I'm gonna need a McMax capture clip. Daniel Judge, thank you for subscribing. Another brand new baby sub. I really appreciate it. Hit recording again. 
And I was hoping to talk more about Kuja. That's one of the things I actually kind of regret I didn't do enough of, Alex. I kind of wish I talked more about Kuja in the script, but I was trying to not make the script too long and make the video too long. Just because I was, I was on such a deadline of getting that out, especially with the sponsor spot. And I was really worried if I just kept making it longer and longer, like Final Fantasy VIII or Final Fantasy VI in length, I was just never going to get it done. So I tried to shorten it up. And I, I do wish I went more in depth about it. Bum, ba, da, bum. You hate Final Fantasy IX because the ending is so satis unsatisfying? That's really weird, because I actually thought Final Fantasy IX had one of the best endings in the series, because I felt that that was one of the few Final Fantasy games where like the ending had like a proper denouement. A lot of the other games just kind of like end. Maybe show you the characters a little bit, but like Final Fantasy IX like did a good job. I mean, like here's what happened to everyone afterwards and spent time with them a little bit. You know, and that happens to a, in a lot of games. Like the the denouement afterwards just usually is end up being non-existent. Can I sell some of these stupid weapons to you? Like I have two scout balls and one is just strictly better than the other. So why would I have this old scout ball? I can just sell it, right? There's no like synthesis or anything similar in this game. Am I playing 10 tier or am I keeping the sequels out of the lineup? I'm keeping the sequels out of the lineup. Because if I did all the sequels, then I would also need to talk about all the other game sequels. So it's not just 10 and 10 2, it's also Final Fantasy 4 After Years, Final Fantasy 4 Interlude, Final Fantasy 7 Dirge of Cerberus, Final Fantasy 7 Crisis Core, Final Fantasy 7 Advent Children, Final Fantasy 12 Revenant Wings, Final Fantasy 13 2, Final Fantasy 13 3 Lightning Returns. Like, that's a lot. And I. I can't. Still like how Beatrix gets sort of away with everything in 9. You can never beat her. A lot of people have talked about like, uh, Beatrix. She's so nice, but, but she got away with genocide. Did I miss something? Because she didn't commit genocide. She fought soldiers and defeated soldiers because that's what she does being a general. Queen Braun commits genocide when she kills entire fucking towns. Beatrix was just doing, in her eyes, honorable fights. Just following orders? Well, I mean, just saying just following orders doesn't, like, absolve someone of any kind of sins or wrongdoing. Didn't her soldiers kill the people of Clara and Bermesia? By my understanding, the people of Bermesia escaped to Clara, and then, in Clara, she was only fighting other soldiers, trying to defend him. And then, uh, it was Queen Braun who's like, nope, kill all Clara. Off to Luca at last. The matches start as soon as we get there. So rest up on the way, yeah? Dun, dun, dun. Oh, is this the uh, boat with the nighttime scene, by the way? Archive, 52 subs. Off to Lucajin? I don't think this boat's horny enough to go off to Lucajin. It is? Great. Well, let's start taking our bets now if I'm going to get the eject shot first go. In fact, I'll even let you bet.
Bet your chat GP. Will Jared get the jack shot? Uh, first try. Take your pets now. For those of you wondering if I remember like the Orif object shot, I do not. I just want to sneak up behind them and beat the... I mean, I want to get in their faces and show them what we're made of. Tournament's coming up real soon. Wish we had more time to practice, yeah. Why do I feel like I'm being watched? Those herbs I bought in Kilika for seasickness are working great, yeah. Weed. Looks like our gals are brewing up something back there. I'd be afraid if I were you. Sorry, what are you doing? My, you're kind of cute too. You want to have some fun? I'm sorry? Are these ladies just here to like, bang? Oh, hey, Some Donna. people can be so rude. Tell me about it. Are you like all up in your boy? It might I'm, not mean much, but good luck in the tournament. I'm pretty sure those ladies were like hired by the other team to like distract them. Is that a waka? They ask a fortune for rags in Beside and Kilika. Wow. My business is in shambles. What's an Oaka to do? I ask ye. Don't know, man. Gonna save the game here. Oops. Hey, Joxum, thanks for the resub. Oh, he's still keeping the binoculars away from me. Ha <laughs> ha That's a good bit. Okay. What y'all talking about? Who are you supposed to be? Ah, I remember him. Guy from Kilika. Huh? You know, one of the Besaid Aurochs said something about winning the cup. Oh, right. You're that idiot. Don't call him that. But he is an idiot. They don't got what it takes to win the cup. Well, they do now that I'm here. Yes, they will win. He used to be the star player of the Xanarkand Aves. Uh. <laughs> yeah, as if anyone lived in those ruins. It's not ruins. There's a big city there. There is. Uh... I, uh, got too close to sin, and... There is a city, really. You know, no fox right. giving. Whatever your ladyship says. Sweet. Hey, Savandrius, with the Twitch Prime, we subby. Hey, Kamari, can I get one of your patented shoves? No? Okay. What's wrong? You seemed kind of mad back there. They were being rude, and... I do believe your Xanarkand exists. I really do, you know? How come? Sir Jekt used to always tell me stories. It'd be great to see your home someday. I'd love to go there. Yeah. So, Yuna, want to come over to my place? Right. Sure. As if I had a place to show her. <laughs> I 
All right. <laughs> ah, you're right. What's the point of subtlety? Oops. Come on, camera angles. Work with me. All right. Now I well, definitely... Oops. Something. Fuck. I wasn't trying to go You'll up there. Take responsibility. Relax, he's bound to know someone in Luca. And if not? He could always join a Blitz team. Anyhow, it's better than just leaving him in Besaid. What? Just leaving him in Luca? What do you want me to do? You know wants to make him a guardian. Hmm? Oh yeah, jeez. There's that too, eh? And whose fault is that? Not mine! It is mine, huh? <laughs> Why do you think she wants to make him a guardian anyway? Because he's Sir Jack's son. All right. Wait, you sure about that? He's really Sir Jack's son. It's hard to say, but Yuna seems to believe so. Okay. There's that crossfade. Okay. Okay. That's all you have to say? Well, yeah, I mean... He's got to decide for himself, yeah? Well, him and Yuna, I guess. You're right, for once. <clears throat> I wonder which is best. Why don't you tell him he should? Should what? Become Yuna's guardian. Why me? Because Yuna can't. Why not? He hates his father. What he was, what he did. Do you really think she can possibly say to him, I want you to be my guardian, like your father was to mine? Aren't you being oversensitive? <sighs> all right, all right. I'll try talking to him after the tournament. Be discreet. I know. It's his decision. He doesn't like his father. Apparently. He told Yuna as much. Hating your own father, huh? Sounds like a luxury to me. I don't even remember my parents. Can't say how I feel about them. I... I was five then, so I remember mine a little. Damn it! Hmm? Sin just takes everything away from us. Nope, oh, nope, oh, just pushing me away. Go to bed, bud. Tournament starts tomorrow morning. I'm sorry. I need some time to think. Never thought the voice so acting in me was bad. You when they see your moves out there, huh? The thing is, the voice acting isn't bad. Like, the voice actors are actually, like, good and do a good job. But there are several moments where the voice directing is bad. And I feel like that's a key difference that a lot of people refuse to acknowledge. They'd rather voice the, blame the voice actor rather than the direction. In the same way that, like, Hayden Christensen is actually a really good actor. However, directed by George Lucas, pretty god-awful. Are you dead? Best to let him sleep. Oh. And a lot of the, um, a lot of, like, the kind of rough delivery of dialogue also comes from the fact that lots of bag of Geisel Greens. A lot of the rough dialogue also comes from the fact that they had to, like, match their language, like the lip flaps, as they call it. Um, and that can be, and like, that's where like a lot of more of the stilted delivery comes from.
I do believe your Xanarkind exists. I really do, you know? I do believe your Xanarkind... Is Final Fantasy XII's voice acting worse? No, Final Fantasy XII's voice acting is really, really fucking good. Except for Vaughn. Alright, let's fucking do this. Ready, chat? Will you get some GP? Let's find out! I'm gonna fuck it up. You just have to, like, press X where the words appear, right? With, like, the direction. Can I spam it? Or if I, like, press X in the wrong direction, is it a constant failure? Or can I just, like, well, smash well, that shit? Trying to follow in my footsteps, are you? I usually charge for lessons, you know. That shot is done like this. You can't do it, kid. But don't worry, my boy. You're not the only one. No one else can do it. I'm the best. The Jackshot Challenge! Memories of that day still haunt Titus and interfere with his concentration. Try to shake off the memories and successfully perform the Jack Shot. For example, when a memory appears in the upper left, press upper left and X. Uh-huh. Should I use the D-pad or the stick? Let's try practicing a little. Yes, please. Okay. It seems like spamming is fine. No you can't do it. You can't. You can't no one else. You can't do it. You are the best. No, fuck! I think I missed you at the end. Did I? Huh. Or did I get it? <laughs> the best. Yeah, right. That blitz ball's never coming back. Whoa! What's that call? Boom. Doesn't have a name. What's Anyone up? can do it if they try. Everyone who said I was going to get so it, 68% of yeah. you, have yourself some GP. <laughs> oh, hey, pretty little lady. Uh, nothing. I'm not showing off. I knew it! I knew you were something special! Okay, yeah, but this guy actually got some, like, pretty impressive pirouettes. Do that again. I knew it! Is that all right? Look at him go! I can't do that! You kidding me? He's like pulling off a 960. That was the jack shot. Wasn't it? Uh. How do you know that? <laughs> Sir Jack showed it to me when I was a child. He, he called it the sublimely magnificent Jack Shot Mark III. Huh. Stupid name, huh? You know what? There is no... Mark one or Mark two, you know? My old man said the name Mark three was just something to hook the crowd. He said they'd come back every night expecting to see Mark one and Mark two. And they really did come back. I used to get so mad. Is he alive, you think? I don't know. Mm. But Sir Jack was my father's guardian. 
So he's famous here, too? Yes. So, if anything happened to him, I should think word would get around fast. Uh-huh. What would you do if you found him? Who knows? I thought he died ten years ago. Well... Would be considered record probably just smack him one. Okay. After everything he put mom and me through. And because he was famous, I was always... Well, you should know, Yuna. Hmm? Your father's famous, too. Everyone in Spira knows him, right? Hmm. Ain't it tough? It is hard to follow in his footsteps as a summoner. Sure. But the honor of having a father like him surpasses all that, I think. Well, there wasn't much to honor about my old man, that's for sure. You shouldn't say that about your father. I got the right. <laughs> I guess you do. Ow! Show me that move again. Yo! I didn't think my old man would come to Luca. He never did like watching other people play. But I couldn't help feeling something bad was gonna happen. And these feelings of mine are usually right. Sure, I had told Waka I'd help him win the tournament, but I wasn't sure I had it in me to play at all anymore. Hell yeah, dude. Fucking nailed it. Not the walkout with the tier 2 resub. Should've got TV cameras here? Isn't that Machina? All the way from Killica, it's the Killica Beasts! I Summoner O'Holland used to play for them, a big name to live up to. Polite clapping. Their hometown was recently attacked by Sin, isn't that right, Jimmy? Yes, Baba, they're gonna be pulling out all the stops to try and bring back the cup this year. Exciting, isn't it, folks? Our next team off the ramp is... Well, well, well. If it isn't, the Basaid Aurox. They're a living, breathing, statistical impossibility. I <laughs> Green Link, thanks for the resub. The goers. That's Steve you Blum. Say that again, Jimma. Look at the crowd, folks. Look at the crowd. Look that guy's got a shitty haircut. Has turned out to cheer the goers on. They know, I know, and you know, folks. The Luca goers are number one. I know, they know, and you know, folks. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's like this every year, yeah? Don't let it bother you. Stop right 
right there, goers. Where'd you get a megaphone? You guys are smiling now, but not for long. Cause this year, us Aurochs are taking the cup. <laughs> what in Yevon's name were you doing up there? We sure stood out, though. We were on the sphere. We were. Maester Micah is here. Already? The number three dot. What's up now? Maester Micah has arrived. That's what. Micah? Maester? Maester Micah is the leader of all the peoples of Spira. He'll be fine. He's come all the way from Bavel. The tournament is being held to honor his 50 years as Maester. 50 years? Shouldn't he be, uh, retired by now? Wow, that's ancient! Hey, I thought 30 now. years old was ancient! Let's all go see him! Praise be to Maester Micah. May he live for all eternity. This song, the song gives me like the vibes of like the installation screen of some other game. Not quite the play online installation screen song. Though that one is like forever burned into my memory. One Ray Ray. Hmm. Can't see a thing. What is that? What is that? Bird person? Are those naming ways? All right. Is Seymour hot? That's a guado, right? Lady Pelvic says so. Who could it be? Isn't that Maester Seymour? That lady's ass is hanging out. People of Spear, I thank you for your generous welcome. Rise, Mr. Seymour, and all of you as well. I present to you the son of Maester Jiskel Guado, who departed for the far plain of Fort Night Pass. As some of you already know, he has been officially ordained a Maester of Yevon. I am Seymour Guado. I am honored to receive the title of Maester. In life, my father Jiskel worked to foster friendship between man and Guado. I vow carry on his legacy, and to fulfill my duties as maester to the best of my abilities. Hmm. What's going on with his torso? Is it like weird body you here, too. or is it like your head. burn marks? I don't know what's... And he's horny. He psychs you up, yeah? All right, last meeting before the match. Hustle! Is it like... I know, his hair is stupid. I don't care what anyone says. The 
the Seymour hair is it's stupid. Just stupid. <laughs> I I don't really uh, Where's Waka? At the matchup draws. We had to play the Gores in the first match last year. The year before that, and the one before that, too. Well, we would have lost to anyone anyway. Captain Walker! <laughs> we're playing the Albed Sykes first. If we win, we're in the finals. Fuck the Albeds! Right, That's team? right, we got seated. Two wins, and we're the champions. First things first. Let's go over the basics again, boys. Holy shit. In Blitzball, there are five players per team in the sphere pool. The overhead map shows all players' current positions. Tidus is carrying the ball now. Yep. Let's watch the players move. Yay! God, it's been too long since I've done this. It may seem confusing at first, but it's actually quite simple. <laughs> Game, you don't get to decide that. You don't get to decide that. Player movement is set to auto. The triangular frame with the red circle is the opposing team's goal. Here it is! On the left. Did you guys do auto movement? I remember always sending it to manual, so I felt like I could actually fucking do something. Now sorry, moving the ball carrier manually. Press triangle! Whoa, manual A! Whee! Whee! But my hit points are at zero. Only the ball carrier can be moved manually. All the players stay on auto. Know that it becomes harder to manage your teammates while manually controlling the carrier. This mode is recommended for veteran blitzers. Oh, it really is super confusing with the camera angles. Please select auto. Oh, I'm sorry. It makes sense if I just, like, watch the map and ignore the camera angles. Shoot! Shoot! In addition to manual A, there's also a mode called manual B. Forget that, though. Action commands. The game pauses. Please select dribble. Dribble. So dribble is swim. Passing. Ugh! Oh, pass! Here, Jasu! Yeah! Stats determine the outcome. Take a look at the number next to PA for pass. The number is 10, which is passing accuracy. Okay, pass it back to Titus. Yeet. Oh, the longer it goes, the lower the accuracy. The friction of the water causes the accuracy to decrease. If it reaches zero, it becomes uncatchable. So I can't just yeet it across the field, got it. Now let's throw a bad pass. Eee. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Well, pass fails. The ball comes loose. Okay. Shooting. Very similar to passing. Uh-huh. A shot that reaches the score with a shot score of at least one will score. The goalkeeper defense teaches his shots. Oops. Shoot. Versus Roddy. Once you select shoot, the goalkeeper's stats appear beneath yours. Your teammate's stats are depicted as a blue background. Enemies are red. Yep. CA is a catch ability. Tired of shoots. From downtown. Ugly shot. Be aware that the actual catch applied here is randomized, ranging from 50 to 150%. Oh, come on. The rebound! Okay. Using hit points. Let's ball the user hit points. Yeah, it's stamina. Uh huh. Yeah, he loses hit points when he moves. Doesn't the jack shot like take hit points to use? Oh no, that uses 10 of my hit points. He's gonna catch it. Oh, never mind. Players can still shoot even if their hit points falls below 10, but they only are half as effective. Whenever HP is too low, the commands are highlighted to blue. We'll also note that shot is reduced from 10 to 5. So, okay. God, I just, I got it! Zoop! Apparently his ability to swim backwards and down is very impressive. Oh, what is encounters? An encounter occurs when opposing players come in contact with the ball carrier. If you're the ball character, the action menu will open. Vixen rushes. For now, select no break. Vixen stand and teaches his way. Pass. Normally the ball is thrown here. It would lose pass as it travels through the water. But in, in an encounter, opposing players try to block your passes and shots. Block represents a player's skill at blocking. Here, stat is two. So it just automatically takes two down. For example, the pass is 10, the block is 2, estimated result is 8. I can math. Here, Letty! Even though he's behind me, he still manages to block? That makes sense. Okay. This time his block is 18. Oh shit. Here, Dado. Eh. Ah. Let's include some multiple encounters. That's right. Ba bomb. Ba 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 bomb. Block of four, block of two. I don't stand a fucking chance. Nope, oh, nope, they both just tipped it. Oh, uh, nope. Idiot. Can you actually lose a tournament? Oh, you can lose. And pretty much unless you get the jack shot, you're going to lose. Now let's try shooting a goal.
It's a block, block, catch. Uh. Boink. Bink. Boop. Okay, breakthroughs. This is a lot of tutorial. Three dudes. You've encountered three opposing players. Passing accuracy currently 17. Yeah. Less than zero. Right. Let's try a breakthrough here. The ball carrier will try to shake off defenders by breaking through their tackles. Let's try a breaking through grav. Keep an eye on grav's at attack. Break to grav. Grav will tackle Titus. If Titus can't withstand the tackle, he'll give up the ball. It takes endurance to withstand tackles. Okay. He tackles hard, but I endure it. Only two defenders remain. Look at the stats shown underneath. Pass. Since Grav is out of the picture, he can't block passes anymore. All right. Ha ha! Bunk! Bink! Did it. Got it. Okay, now it's tech copy. Holy shit. All right. Players can learn techniques from their opponents. This is called tech copy. First, one of your players mark an opponent that knows a desirable technique. Now that player will keep an eye on the opponent in order to learn their techniques. Select Brick to Bricks in here. Tech copy appears at the top of the screen when a player uses a technique during the game. This indicates an opportunity to learn. Press X at the right time to learn it. Venom tackle! Oops. When do I press it? Oh, it says talk copy in the le upper left. Okay. The techniques. Okay. Stats, hit points, endurance, passing accuracy, shooting skill, attack, lock, catch. Okay. All right, fuck it. I'm just going to go. Why well, be good? Thanks for the resub. Someone said they saw Sir Oren in a cafe. Neat! Uh, Oren? Yes, Sir Oren. Let's go find him. Hey! Hey, 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 hey! The game starts, like, real soon. You come back quick, yeah? Hey, I'll be back. Yeah, okay. Remember that time when hey, Waka. Tita showed up during halftime and no, they won the like bourbon bowl? Face. Just breathe out, relax. Okay. Like this. <clears throat> Just breathe. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe now we can find Sir Jack. Huh? How? Sir Oren was also my father's guardian. So, he might know where Sir Jekt is. Let's go now. Yeah. It didn't even occur to me to think that the RN Yuna was talking about. And the one that I knew from Xanarkin could be two different people. I don't know why, but I knew it was the same guy. I knew it was the same Orin. Really, how many people are named Orin? Can I use the save here? Here we go. It's crowded out there. 
Stay close. Imito Sumana. Vasikna Bund. Hey! Albed Sykes, right? What's up? Some Albed saved me the other day, and this girl Riku gave me food, and. Uh. <laughs> you don't understand me, do you? Uh. Uh, anyway, if you meet Riku, tell her thanks for me. Oh, and as for the first game, may the best team win. The fuck you say? No admittance. Once the tournament is over, the operation will commence. Better enjoy Blitzball while I can. Hello. The opening ceremony is about to begin. It's another chill song. And now for the halftime show, it's Yuna! What can I do for you? What can I do for you? <laughs> I'm sorry. Please let me through. Hey, let's go. This sounds a lot like the play online installation song. Hold on. You're really famous. <laughs> I hope we don't get separated. Yuna. Let me check something. Um All right, maybe not quite. It's close, though. In Xanarkin, we do this to cheer on Blitz players. You try it, too. Put your fingers in your mouth like this. Like this? Uh-uh. Not like that. This. Uh, then you just blow. I can't do that. It's not working. I can whistle, but I can't Practice. do the finger whistle thing. Okay. Hey, use that if we get separated. Then I'll come running, okay? <laughs> well, guess we should just stick together then. Until you can do it. Yes, sir. a pretty big town. Luca is the second largest city in Spira. Neat. That kid's got a balloon. I thought every town was little. You know, like Besaid and Kilika. Towns don't usually get bigger than that. Because when a lot of people start to gather... Sin? Hmm. What about Luca? It's safe here? It's not any different, but the stadium is here. The Crusaders fight to protect it with all their strength. They protect the stadium? Blitzball is really the only entertainment that we have. Spira's a little short on fun these days. Damn. Whoa. <laughs> Talk about pressure. <laughs> That's right. Is Xanarkand like this too? Hmm. 
Just well, spin it in are circles. More buildings, all tall ones, and cramped together. Oh. They must be so tall. Don't you ever get dizzy? <laughs> Let's go find Sir Oren. Give me that balloon. I got a red balloon. Bet you want one too. Give it to me. Give them a balloon. They're happy campers. Kids are so innocent and easy to please. On account of them being dumb. stuff around here I hate it when this cafe is so packed me too dude where am I going Ooh, treasure thousand dollars dude hell yeah hmm uh oh what you doing here the tournament's about to start. I'll be back. I'm looking for someone. Well, you're looking in the wrong place. There aren't many people here. Everyone's either at the stadium or watching the game on the sphere. They love their blitz ball. Aren't you gonna watch? We'd like to, but we're waiting for some couriers. Hmm, they're late. Wanna ditch the courier and go watch the game? Yeah, fuck them. But, but we're still on duty. What about the mission, sir? Uh... See what I mean? We might be a little late, but we will go watch you play. You better be winning when we get there. Uh, yes, sir. I just left Yuna up there. See you later. Nope, you made it. Okay. Hey, no one here looks like Oren. That lady needs to put on some pants, though. <sighs> Oren's not here. Hmm. Why not talk, Kimari? Uh oh. Not see Yenke for ten years. Say something. Kimari forget Yenke? Forget Biran? Leave Kimari, Yenke. Kimari is small, Ranzo. <laughs> Kimari so small can see Yenke and Biran's faces. <laughs> Kimari forget Ronso friends? We taught you much at time of Hornmold. Biran taught Kimari to be strong, Ronso. Maybe taught too much. Take him on. <laughs> Just like everyone's story in this game is everyone gets bullied. <laughs> Show on you again! Outside, the tournament's starting, you hear? The game! Today, on this glorious day, players from all over Spira have assembled here to participate in this great contest of bravery, skill, and strength. All of these fine teams, equally renowned, deserve to win the cup today. Such is the nature of this contest. Let us, the spectators, play our role accordingly. Let us sing to the glory of the winners and applaud equally the valor of the defeated. Contestants, may heaven be with you.
Yeah, fill the ball sphere somehow. Get like some warm up swims, maybe do some laps. Donkey Bard with the resub. Thank you, Donkey. The crowds are going so wild, they have up to five frames per minute. Also, I need to go back to the match. Gear for Killjoy, being a brand new sub. Where in Spira have you been? Huh? Yuna's been kidnapped by the Al Bed Sykes. Holy shit. In exchange for her safe return, they want the Aurochs to lose. What? If they're only Blitzball players, I doubt they'd do anything drastic. But we Sounds like they chances. suck. Let's go get her. I'm going too. This will be no problem. They're telling the Aurochs to throw the game, as if they needed to. I mean, how good a team can they be? Waka said the same thing. He'll take care of the game. We should go get Yuna. The Albed boat is in dock four. Let's go. Okay. Don't you only play like one half of the Blitzball game? Oh, what's up, dude? The stores in the stadium are closed on a tournament, but I'm always active for business. Got any weapons? Stunning steel. Rule breaker, thunder spear. Ooh, plus five magic points. I don't want those. The people here are so into the game they don't even look at what they're buying. Gotta love them. Well. Got any items? No. Ice and snow from the holy peaks of Gagazet have strengthened Runzo's spirit. Makina! Whoa, what are they? Ancient Makina salvaged by the Albed. They are mostly vulnerable to lightning. Ha! Oh, vulnerable lightning? Maybe I should have got the lightning spear for Kamari. Got any things? Nope. Bap, 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 oh. uh, moving up to surround him. That's kind of cool. He's got 15 hit points. Get him. He's got one hit point. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> nice. Treasure. Do the characters moving around in battle affect anything? Is it just a visual thing? It's just a visual thing. 
think I'm gonna buy that Thunder Spear so that Kimari sucks just a little bit less. Well. Oh, shit, I am poor. One second. Better not be a thunder spear. Okay. It's gonna say, I swear to God. Title spear? No. Oh, look, you can see the match on the screen. Ah, we're getting our asses kicked. Oh, right, Yuna. Uh. Yeah. Uh, another guy somewhere around here. You'll fight anyone who doesn't think Titus is the worst protagonist in the main series. Titus is not the worst protagonist in the main series. Vaughn is. Lord Arceus, thanks for the fifty dollars. I really appreciate it. It means a lot. Thank you. Hope is bad too. I mean, I don't like Hope either, but Hope is not a main protagonist. Main character, sure, but not like the like focal of the story, you know. Why does everyone hate on Titus so much? I don't know. It's kind of new to me, to be honest. I do like no damage to these guys. Wow, that did not really improve his damage, did it? Fucking rip. Okay. How does this work? Do I have to kill him with it or just hit him once and he'll drop sp speed spears or... No, no, I dropped one. And a fire Moomba! A Moomba! I mean, I guess Kimar's doing more damage than Titus right now, so that's something. Bop, 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 bop. What's up with these oh guys? Boy.
He's a dad's blade to Lulu. Big crit. The Albed were expecting us. Hmm. Dodge. Fun cat gifting a sub. You die. Sphere level up. Five high potions? Heck. I'm Cat gifting a lot more subs, and Zora also gifting a sub. Meanwhile. The Aurochs are keeping the score tied with some excellent defense, folks. Holy shit, they actually got two scores? That's amazing. Oh, he'll feel that one in the morning. Ah, but the referee doesn't call the foul. Wack is taking a real beating out there. Huh. Still in there. Yeah. He won't last. Waka's always like that. Ouch. Let's go. Save the game. What's this way? Oh, let's just back that way. We're gonna put the Sailor Moon skirt on again. It's Sailor Mercury, you uncultured swine. And two, I don't know. Next convention. Shit, the boat. Let's go. Again, Lulu's ability to like stay moving with all those belts as a dress is kind of impressive. Must have super beefy legs. Crane. I want to see. Use crane. <laughs> Come on, move. It's probably out of power. seems to respond. Actually, oh, does a lightning spear do it at all? Nope, never mind. Do they need more? Come on, move! It's probably all right. It does need more. Okay. I like how. The outbed blitzball team's like, we'll just shoot him with blitz balls. Psst. Wake up, damn it. Psst. 
it's rumbling. <laughs> Beep boop. Did he with an electric weapon count? I couldn't even target with an electric weapon, so I guess not. Crane game! Mine. Jesus. Get some hit points out of him. Ha ha! Once again, Lulu handles everything. And that guy's dead. A metal bangle? Whoa, I got an elixir already? Sweet. Holy shit. I can't wait to not use that until after the credits. Xanthorian Knight with a Twitch Prime Risa. Thank you. I hope you hurt them. <laughs> Holy shit, Lulu. <laughs> what is it? There were these all bed that saved my life when I first came to Spira. They took me on their ship. They even gave me food. I was kind of hoping that this was the same ship. But it's not. I wonder if they're all gone. What happened? Sin came up near us. I made it out okay, but I don't know what happened to their ship. Um, was there anyone called Sid on that ship? I don't know. They were all speaking that Al Bed language. I see. So who's Sid? He's my uncle, but I've never actually met him. Mm-hmm. Wait, so that means you're Albed too, Yuna? On my mother's side, yes. Sid is my mother's brother. He became distant after my mother married. So Lord Braska married an Albed? But she told me to seek him out if I ever needed help. Everyone was cool with that. You're worried he was... Push mark. Don't tell Waka about Yuna's lineage. The thing about Waka, he never had much love for the Albed. Whoa! I I gotta tell Waka. What did what she just say? To tell Waka. The game. Oh. A signal flare? 30 seconds left. The Aurochs are launching an all-out offensive. Ah, they saved Yuna. Now we can beat him up. A long pass from Letty. Letty to Waka. Waka with the rebound from downtown. It's good. Waka's kidneys are failing. Not the most graceful win. If it was Chapu, he'd still be standing. Damn, Lulu. Hey, aren't you being just a little unfair? Excuse me? I know I could never take Chapu's place. You're the one who told Waka that, right, Lulu? And I don't think Waka would ever try to take Chapu's... You don't want to finish that sentence. You see, Lulu really liked Chapu. Treasure?
Nope, nope. Treasures! Fuck yeah, magic spear? And a hit point spear? Tight. Save the game right there. And let that capture clip export. the YouTube recording here as well because it's been going for quite some time and this will be quite the export and it'll take a long time so if you're watching this on YouTube hey very much appreciate it but don't forget you can watch me live over at twitch.tv slash projer if you want to watch this live along with everybody else it'd mean a lot to me if you came on by by the way thanks for watching the VOD much love and I'll see you later YouTube